Welcome to the That's Good Sports Superb Bowl Stream. All right, we've got right four, four, four hours of this. Four and a half hours? I don't know how long. No, the Super Bowl's longer. Uh, welcome. Welcome, everyone, watching along while we watch this game. I know there are some Chiefs fans here. There are some 49ers fans here. Congratulations. Your team made it. You got something to root for. And then there are just a lot of us football fans. are. We're just watching. Our team didn't make it. Maybe we don't want one team to win the Kansas City Chiefs. Maybe we want another team to win the 49ers. Don't know. We're all over the map here. What I do know is if you're rooting for the, the meteor or for everybody to lose, don't. Pick a team. Invest your emotional well-being in one team and let the result of this game ruin the rest of your week. Okay? If your team loses, they win, then you get a good week. You get a good week. But don't root for everyone to lose because it can't happen in the Super Bowl. It's literally one of the few games in the NFL that can't result in a tie. Everybody cannot lose. So it's probably going to be the Chiefs that win. Probably going to be the Chiefs that win. But I am praying to the football gods that the 49ers with all the talent they have, make it work. Christian McCaffrey gets that 180 yards I predicted he needs to get. Uh, they they just don't let Purdy get sacked. We sack Mahomes. Just feels like the Chiefs will win in a grind it out, ugly fashion. But I actually think this will be a good game. I do. As a Bengals fan, let's go Usher. <laughs> oh, that's fair. That's fair. You can root for Usher. Root for a team, or you can also root for Usher. 50. What are we doing? Oh, I'm not, I don't have all my normal clips. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, because I'm in my that's good Broncos one. 50. Let's we run. All right, we got the national anthem going. Reba McIntyre. National anthem. Game might start on time. Game might start on time. Uh, obviously, Grassi, Johnny Barks are there at the Super Bowl. Hope you guys have been following them on the socials after Tom won Fan of the Year. Been very cool to see them. <laughs> it looks like they're at the very back of the stadium with their seats, but they're actually at the gate, which is pretty sick. Yes, I'm still your girl's favorite sports, hockey. Thank you, George. Thank you, George. Perna, you have been taking it up the old poop shoot all season long. Well, get ready for one more angry dolphin. <laughs> Go Chiefs. Man, I thought that, I thought you were going to wish me luck. I thought you were going to hope for the opposite. But uh, you decided to give me more pain. I hate the Chiefs. I hate Mahomie. I hate Reed. I hate the organization as a whole. So you're rooting for the Chiefs, Nate? Nice. Just pulled 600 on a deadlift for the first time. Going to be a good day. See you soon. Kevin, that is very impressive. I don't even know what I could deadlift. But I know after you lift 600 pounds, you're going to be too tired to kick my ass, Kevin. You're going to be too tired to kick my ass. Speaking for the entire Bills Mafia, go Niners. Yeah, do you, are, are, are Lions fans rooting for the Chiefs? That's what I want to know. Obviously, the Niners beat the Lions to get there. Lions fans now rooting for the Chiefs. They've got no interest. Bills fans certainly rooting for the Niners. Um, I'm sure Ravens fans are rooting for the Niners, Broncos fans, Raiders fans, Chargers fans rooting for the Niners. And there's so many Broncos connections for the Niners. So that's also why, why I feel good about rooting for them. It's not just a, like a, a hate, a hate route where I got to root for, you know, the worst of two evils. Like I want to see Kyle Shanahan get a Super Bowl ring. 
birth from Mike Shanahan's ball sack, like in Colorado. That's his color. Well, I don't know if he was actually born in Colorado. I think he was. Hmm. Hmm. Where was Kyle? What's what state was Kyle Shanahan born? I don't know. Christian McCaffrey certainly birthed from Colorado. You got Brian Greasy over there, Anthony Lynn on the coaching staff, a lot of Colorado ties. So genuinely would be happy to see all those guys. And of course, Brock Purdy. I think that's the best story, the best storyline for the NFL. To see a Mr. Irrelevant win a Super Bowl, that's crazy. That is crazy. As a fellow Denver fan, I have to make it known that the Broncos beat the Chiefs outright. They also beat the Browns and Vikings, who beat the 49ers. Sounds like the Broncos are the best team in the NFL. You know what? For a stretch there, Tom, they really were. They really, really were for a stretch there. We got 1,700 people in here, 1,800. Can we get to 1,000 likes before this game even starts? Grassi's not streaming, so my goal is to be the number one stream during the game, and I need your help. Super Bowl's weird uh, for the streams. It's not as popular as the other ones because a lot of people go out, they go to Super Bowl parties and all that stuff. So this is for all the people watching in their basement like me alone. Rock here, like the stream. Let's get to number one. At the Chiefs. F Taylor and it's whoa. Okay. We don't have to, we don't have to, we don't have to be mean to Taylor. We really don't. We don't. As a Bengals fan, love you, Perna. Greetings from Germany. Yeah, let's just say F the Chiefs' chances of winning. Gronk's gonna kick the fan duel kick. Does he make it this? No, he shanked it. Gronk shanked it again. Oh, Gronk. Gronk shanked another field goal. Australian punters, number one. I agree. I have never agreed with a super chat so much in my life. Love from Grassi Posse. Well, thank you, Brian. Hate the Chiefs. Hate the 49ers even more as an Eagles fan. Can never root for another NFC team. Go Chiefs. Fly, Eagles. Fly. Is it easier as an Eagles fan to root for the Chiefs because Jason and Travis? Like, does that make it a little easier for you? Packers fan here. Don't like either of them at all, but I'm more fine with the Niners winning. I want to know that we lost to the best. Yeah. See, I when when the Broncos lost to the Ravens uh, after the 2012 season, I was like, I hope the Ravens win the Super Bowl because then it's fate. It's destiny. There's nothing the Broncos could do about it. It helps. It helps a little bit. I understand that mindset. Who's happy about Super Bowl 58? If you're not a Chiefs or a 49ers fan, absolutely nobody. Commercials for the win. Yeah, I mean, the Niners just don't feel like they're as popular as they used to be. Maybe that changes with the win. Um, you know, maybe if Brock Purdy wins Super Bowl MVP. I don't mind the Niners being there. I think the Niners getting there instead of the Lions is what soured a lot of people on the game because we thought we had this opportunity to watch something miraculous. And we, I mean, Mr. Irrelevant getting the Super Bowls close, close to as miraculous as uh, the Lions. <clears throat> Kyle's from Minneapolis. Oh, really? Kyle Shanahan was born in Minneapolis. What was Shanny doing in Minneapolis? Being a Raiders fan, I'm rooting for our stadium to have a sinkhole and swallow the field. At least I'm not a Broncos fan. Aunt Berna, love you. I mean, as a Raiders fan right now, I don't know. Maybe. There's more hype, positive hype around your coach. We both need quarterbacks. I don't think either of us have it great right now. But, like, the equivalent, I think, right now for Broncos fans would be if we were hosting the Super Bowl in Denver and the Chiefs got there and then also, like, the, the Seahawks were in the Super Bowl. That would kind of be rough for the Broncos. Shout out to you because once you heard that Tom was nominated for Fan of the Year, you 100% knew he's winning it. Go Provident Steamroller. Yeah, I've never been so certain about something I – had no control over and didn't know in my life. But I was just like, oh yeah, that makes so much sense. And who did more than Tom? 
for for the NFL as a whole and for the fan of his team over the course of a year. He did all that. I mean, it was crazy. It's crazy. I'm here at a Super Bowl party in my barracks. Oh, nice. Chiefs have won the coin toss and they defer. Already Kyle Shanahan's losing. He likes to defer. Kyle Shanahan likes to defer. This is not a good start for the 49ers. I'm watching the CBS and Nick coverage, and it's good to hear Patrick shitting on anyone but our QB. Well, what if, if Patrick Starr roasts Patrick Mahomes in the Super Bowl? Oof. Hi, my name is Afton. Well, hello, Afton. The Kelsey connections, uh, it helps rooting for the Chiefs, but so does Andy Reid. He's still respected in Philly. Yeah, he should be too. I wish I could hate Andy Reid. I really do, but I can't. He's, he's too damn lovable, that Andy Reid. He's too lovable. As an Eagles fan, this is not easy. Hate the Chiefs, uh, the team that beat us last year, and I am so over Taylor, but Niners fans claim they win last year. Purdy never got hurt, and Debo claimed. Oh, yeah, there's all that. there was all that trash talk from Debo and the Eagles. I get it. I get it, guys. That makes sense. I watched the Broncos beat the Packers on a road trip in Grand Lake in the offseason. As a Lions fan, I'm now rooting for the Niners due to those three old guys and the bartender. Nice. Grand Lake in Colorado? Or uh, Oklahoma? Which Grand Lake? I'm a Cardinals fan, so go Chiefs. Be honest, both teams can get whatever is short of penile frostbite, though. Nice callback, Matt. Nice callback. We got a thousand likes yet. I need a thousand likes before this game starts. My goal is to be the number one stream during the Super Bowl, and I need your help. No penile frostbite in the Las Vegas Dome. As a Pack fan, I hate that I want the Chiefs to win. Ooh, yeah. Niners? Niners ruined a lot of teams' dreams. Teams that had some real hope that we didn't expect. Packers, the Lions. Yeah, I get it. Go Mahomes. Also, Reed is a lovable food critic. Yeah, we all love Andy. That's good sports is the best in my opinion. That is correct. That's probably the most factual thing that will be said all stream. Rams fans, so I wouldn't mind KC winning because at the 49ers, plus they never did anything to us. Yeah, it's easier if the one of the teams in there hasn't hurt you bad, right? They never embarrassed your team. Like if the Dolphins were in there right now, after what they did to the Broncos this season, and as I mean, but I love Mike McDaniel, but they did hurt me. Mm, that's conflicting. Well, you're welcome, Theo. You're the only thing keeping Broncos fans happy. I agree. And that eight game or that that win streak we had that was that helped. <laughs> Chiefs L would be sweeter than a tree ripened pear. Cameron, another great callback. Super Bowl winning the Super Bowl is amazing, but have you ever had a tree ripened pear? Mina Kimes on the GPS stream win. Oh, we can make that happen, Edward. Soon, I'll reach out. I'd love to talk to Mina. Go Meteor. Perna, do the Chiefs have to play at my house? Why must the football gods torment me like Guillermo, man? I know, that sucks. That is not a fun thing to see in your own home. I will say Las Vegas feels like a great Super Bowl destination. I wasn't there, but like from the outside looking in, it just feels like the right place for a Super Bowl. Why couldn't you and the other clickbaiters do a stream together? Well, I got to go with you over tree because i am loyal member of the perna peeny posse come on let's pee for the p-o-p that's a good question rico um uh, thirty dollars rico go chargers go <laughs> um if all four of us were streaming it's probably too much to do a game Two's a little, like, a two's nice. So if it was just me and Tree doing it, that would probably work really well. Oh, Scooter's there. 
three. I don't know. Also, we just didn't think about it. <laughs> Greetings from Northwest Indiana. Streaming you and Tree while muting the TV. Have a great stream. Hell yeah. Make sure everybody goes and likes Tree's stream too. Let's make us the one and two streams. If Tree's number one and I'm number two, I'm cool with that. As long as we're tops. It's going to be hard to beat Cole, though. He is a Chiefs guy. All right. Opening kickoff is coming. Here we go. Kick is in the back of the end zone. We got a good old-fashioned touchback. I don't care what AFC team, win, AFC team wins the Super Bowl so long as it isn't New England or the Raiders. The fickin' Raiders. The fickin' Raiders. Fickin', fickin'. Trying to say it the way you spelled it. Who are your top five QBs? Is that a future video? I don't know. I don't know if the world really cares enough about my top five quarterbacks. All time, Peyton Manning, number one. John Elway, number two. First play here, handoff to McCaffrey, and he's going to get a nice five, maybe six yards. They're going to call it six. All right, we need McCaffrey to have a big, a big game for the 49ers to have a shot. All right. Need strong push from that Niners offensive line. Did we hit 1,000 likes? Oh, my God. We're 41 likes short of 1,000. Come on. Game started. We can still do it. Second and four coming up for the San Francisco 49ers. They are right above that Super Bowl logo. Well, play action. Purdy rolls out, dumps it off. He's got Kyle Juszczyk who hurdles a dude, and he is tackled at the 49-yard line. There we go. There we go, San Fran. Hurdle on the second play by your fullback? Oh, my God. Football nerds are just losing their mind right now. Oh, use. We got juiced. We <laughs> got juiced. Oh. I'd have to probably put Mahomes in that top five, honestly. Probably Aaron Rodgers. All right. First and 10. Purdy just stands in the pocket, literally doesn't move at all, and then fires a dart to McCaffrey, and he's going to pick up 11. Enough for a sec, another San Francisco first down. So we got what Elway, Manning, Mahomes, Aaron Rodgers, and hmm, hmm. I mm, no, I'm not doing him. Hmm. Jake Plummer. Currently streaming in the back of a trailer. Can't miss the Perna stream. Let's ride. Thank ride. <laughs> Let's ride. <laughs> Thank you, Steve. First and 10 here. Inside handoff to Christian McCaffrey. And now he just powers his way for like 12 or 13 yards right up the gut. The Niners are moving the ball. Mm, these scripted plays right now from Kyle Shanahan looking perfect. All right. I got I to gotta find this use check hurdle. NFL. Got to tweet this. First and 10. Got another handoff to McCaffrey. Ball's out. Ball is out. And it looks like the Chiefs recover. Oh, shit. No. Please let him be down. Please let him be down. Oh, dear God. Oh, fuck. No. No. This is McCaffrey. He never fumbles. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's a fumble for sure. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Of course. Of course. The Niners got to turn it over on the first series. After just perfectly executing every play until then. And it was McCaffrey fumbling of all guys. The guy you trust the most on that offense. It's cursed. Niners are cursed. Well, at least I know now. I know, uh, let's see here. 
I know two minutes and 45 seconds into the Super Bowl that the 49ers are cursed. So I don't have to have any hope that they'll win. Oh, God, this is not ideal, San Francisco. Every game, every game this postseason, San Francisco, just the first half is their their Achilles heel. And it's not good if 30 minutes of, of gameplay are your weakness. <laughs> Only one that deserves to stream because Tom is indisposed today. Thank you, Scott. As a Dolphins fan, I want this game to end in a tie. Can't. It can't happen. Wish it could, but it can't. Yep, NFL script writers already fucked up. Too soon for a plot twist. Jeebus wants nothing to do with the duper soul. <laughs> you should have said Jeebus. Should have said Jeebus. Oh, my God. I do not like this at all. Do not like it. I told you, losing that opening coin toss really, really messed with the Niners. Really messed with the Niners. Just, in, just annoyed. I'm annoyed because <clears throat> San Francisco is moving the ball so well. Oh. Yeah, that's just good defense. That's just good defense, getting that ball out. All right, first play for the Chiefs offense from the 27. Three and out would really go a long way here. And, ooh, Pacheco stuffed in the backfield. He's going to lose a couple yards there. All right, there you go. That's a good good first defensive play by the 49ers. Lo loss of three. Loss of three. Oh, yeah. So well-deserved. One of the most well-deserved and earned awards I have ever seen. And I've not seen a lot of them in real life. I haven't been a lot of uh, uh, close close to them. Second play, quick pass here to Kelsey. And he, Kelsey, and he's wrapped up right away. He's going to get one yard. So we got third and 12 coming up from Kansas City. If the 49ers can just three and out him here, let those nerves settle a little bit, that'll be all right. Just don't give up the big play. Do not give up the big play. Didn't you predict a Christian McCaffrey fumble in your scripted video? I don't even remember. Probably. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> oh, okay. Third and 12, Mahomes steps back, rolls to his right, dumps it off. Is that McKinnon? And he's well short of the first down. So the Chiefs are going to punt, going three and out. Niners avoid disaster there. Good coverage. It's kind of crazy to see McKinnon out there. He had surgery on his like abdomen like six weeks ago or some shit. So nice. I like Jerick McKinnon. Just don't want to see him do well today. What could be his last game? All right, Townsend back to punt. He's good. He'll never make a mistake. Punt is off, and it's a boomer. Fielded at the 25. Had to be fair caught. That was a 43-yard punt. Had room to run, but he had to run up to catch it. So I think he caught, he waved for the fair catch a little early there. All right, first two series. Christian McCaffrey ends a nice drive with a fumble, and then the Chiefs go three and out. Niners defense looking, looking juiced on that opening series. 
If I'm Kyle Shanahan, first play on the second drive, I go right back to Christian McCaffrey. Let him shake it off. Go right back to him. That's what I do. You may, wait, may you please say when the next play starts to match both your video and YouTube? Yes. Yes, Jonathan, I can do that. We got 3,000 people in here watching. Thank you guys so much for joining. Make sure you subscribe here to That's Good Sports. If you're new, we do football videos all week, every week. I live stream a football show with Tom Grassi three days a week, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday morning. Nothing but shitty jokes in football. That's what this channel is. We got 1,300 likes. We're all watching the Super Bowl together. One big, happy, weird family. But yes, Jonathan, could you live stream when you and Jess watch Coach? <laughs> no. <laughs> That's a lot of streaming. That's a <laughs> lot of streaming, Matt. How's the bandwagon bowl? Meteor win yet? Not yet, Jeremy. Not yet. So far, it's tied. 0-0. Zero, zero. Let's dip into that box score real quick. See, Purdy was 2 for 2. Mahomes 2 for 2. 9 yards, 29 yards. McCaffrey had those 3 carries for 19. Kyle Juszczyk doesn't show up on the stat sheet, but he did have a hurdle. Don't forget he had a hurdle. And then the big bad play, the fumble from McCaffrey. Hmm. All right. Yeah, I'm not even paying attention to the commercials. Got an Usher promo for the halftime. Our Lord and Savior, Kadarius Tony, make a play for the 49ers defense, please. Well, Matt, you're praying to uh, a God that doesn't exist because Kadarius Tony is inactive today. Healthy scratch. Not going to play. Andy Reid was not going to um, risk it with Kadarius. Why NFL fans seem to hate success? Every team that wins a couple of Super Bowls soon become the worst no judging, just trying to understand. Well, that's true. I think I, I do not like sustained success from a single organization. Mostly because like I just like to see something different. But when that when that team's a division rival, then yeah, you gotta hate them. You gotta hate them immediately. Got to. All right, first and ten for the 49ers. I'm gonna tell you when the play starts. It is starting right now. Snapped. Well, play action. Purdy has time over the middle. Is that Ayuk? Yes, it is. First down. 18-yard pickup by Brandon Ayuk. Quinn Fawcett. I'm at work all night, so thank you for streaming the Super Bowl. You're welcome, Quinn. Enjoy listening. That's a nice pass by Purdy. So far, Purdy's had really good protection. I was just his third drop back, but right now... The protection's there. 9.42 on the clock, 9.41. Ooh, a little jet sweep there to Debo Samuel. Nowhere to go, though, and he's going to lose two yards. The Chiefs were all over that one. Sneed leading the charge, I believe, on the tackle there, and Bolton as well. Tom wants to now go by NFL Fan of the Year, Tom Grassi. You shall refer to me as NFL Fan of the Year, Tom Grassi, every time I am addressed. That's, yeah, that's correct. Second and 12 at the 40-yard line, San Francisco. Ah, uh, we got our first penalty. I know somebody's got a bet on the first penalty. It's going to be a false start on the 49ers. So instead of second and 12, we're backing up to second and 17. Yeah, I can't grassy and chill if I'm streaming the stream. Kadarius Tony was made inactive today. Yes, 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 yes. F the Chiefs love a Broncos fan. Well, thank you, Firefly567. Five, five, All right, Niners get the first turnover and the first penalty. Can they also now just get the first score? Or are they going to have all of the worst firsts? 
Thank you. 26 seconds behind. You're that far behind? Purdy, second and 17, or I'm that far behind. I'm on the antenna. We got a penalty flag. Purdy dances, throws to an open Kittle. He's going to pick up a first down, but I feel like this has to be holding on the 49ers offensive line. Purdy rolled. Yeah, so now second and 27 is what we're getting. Now, I'm on the uh, antenna, so. In football, as in life, it's not about the size of the frog in the fight, but the size of the fight in the frog. Yeah, and also whether or not that frog is poisonous. That helps a lot, too. All right, second and 27. This is not going well for the 49ers. Back-to-back -back penalties. 819 left in the first quarter here. Now on the 25 yard line. Purdy, quick pass to McCaffrey. They get a little bit of a screen set up there. They'll get a chunk back there, maybe eight yards. Yeah, third and 19 coming up. Exactly eight yards. TV says third and 20. What do I know? Hey, Perna, your buddy from south of you. This Super Bowl match up sucks, but hopefully should be a good game. Got to go for the Chiefs, though. Hate the 49ers. That's your prerogative, Darian. Appreciate the super chat. Where south? Pueblo? You in Pueblo? Colorado Springs? Albuquerque? Third and 20. Can the 49ers pick it up? They're going to let Brock Purdy throw. Quick pass to Debo over the mid middle. He breaks one tackle, spins, pushes his way forward, but he's going to be about seven yards shy. Yeah. It's tough when you pick up 13 yards and you still got seven more to go. So Niners going to punt. Hopefully they can pin the Chiefs deep. The scripted first few plays were effective, but the fumble, of course, then the penalties. Kyle Shanahan's got to overcome the adversity. That's how he makes his mark. Come on, just a good punt. Pin him, pin him. And now we got another flag. And this is okay if it's the 49ers. False start, San Francisco. Gives them a little more room for the punt. They're in that weird spot where it's easy to just kick it too hard. Hey, Perna, so I'm a Patriots slash Green Bay fan from Australia. Ooh, I'm watching a show that's in Australia right now. What's it called? The Tourist. I've read a lot of books based in Australia as well. Punt is off. I'll get to, I'll finish this. Fielded at the five, going to be returned. Is that Hardman? And he is tackled at the 11. Chris Conley makes the tackle. Former former chief Chris Conley. Okay, in my country sport, my favorite team is also tied for most championships, but the team is called Collingwood Magpies, black and white colors. Patriots fan, Green Bay fan from Australia. My country sport, my favorite team. Is your country sport rugby? Hmm. What's it? So they they need another championship. You're telling me the magpie. You know what? I'm rooting for the magpies to get another championship. So they have the most. There you go. Magpies, man. Ooh, we got some dragons. Nick Offerman. And April. For Mountain Dew. Hell yeah. I don't even know what they're saying, but that had to be a good one. Chargers fan here. What's your honest opinion on the next season for the bolts with all the changes that Harbaugh has already made? Um, I think it's good. It's ultimately going to be good. I think you're going to see Justin Herbert play to his max potential. That should scare other people because he's been really good, and I don't think we've seen that yet. It could easily be a thing where the Chargers are very good next season. I think it's going to be like a, a, a two-year plan is my, my take in that I think the Chargers will look better maybe like what, like nine and eight next year? 
um, or 10 and seven, maybe playoffs. I don't know. Like that would be a huge improvement, obviously. But I think like 2025 would be the season where I would realistically expect the Chargers to be very good. And I think they are. I think Harbaugh's a great head coach. He's really good with quarterbacks. They're going to build a solid team. They're trying. They're, I I saw like the the rumors about they might be trying to trade like Bosa or Khalil Mack. And honestly, I might trade Bosa just because he's always injured. Maybe you can get more from him because he's still younger than Mack. I don't know. Is he younger than Mack? I should know that shit. But we'll see. I think it's going to be good. They're going to be a tough team. I just don't know if they'll be that team next year. You're only about 10 seconds behind my TV. I like it for a few fleeting seconds. I know more about the game than you. Yeah, and my team, I'm, I'm on it as fast as I can be right now with the antenna. <clears throat> Super Bowl XL vibes so far. I really should learn Roman numerals. Is that Super Bowl 15? 15? Is that 15? No, that can't be 15. What's XL? 49? Is that 49? Roman numerals. I'm going to just say this. They're fucking stupid. The fact that the NFL still uses those stupid things, that nobody knows how to count them, ridiculous. Makes us all feel stupid when we look at a Super Bowl logo. All of the Buffalo is betting on the 49ers. All of Buffalo betting on the Niners to win. I hope so. All right. Chiefs starting off here at the 11-yard line. 628 left in the first. Mahomes inside handoff here to Pacheco, and he's got a running lane. Takes a shot at the end there, but not before picking up 11 yards. 10. It would be Broncos luck for the hope they had for Russell Wilson era to end after two years with zero playoffs, zero winning seasons, and two chief Super Bowls. Yeah, that's hell. Can we not talk about that during this Super Bowl, Christopher? I don't need to be reminded of my own team's shortcomings right now, Christopher. First and 10, Mahomes drops back, and he is sacked. Oh, yes. Is that Chase Young? Ooh. Oh, I said he needed to show up and get some sacks, and he does. Oh, yeah, he gets right by Smith at, on the edge there. And if he didn't get to Mahomes, Bosa would have. There you go. Make Mahomes uncomfortable. Nice to see all the penalties are going for the 49ers. Yeah, I don't think it's I don't think it's lopsided. I think they're just first team to make mistakes. Second and 14, quick pass to Rice, and he is tackled immediately by Fred Warner. Maybe loses a half a yard there. Woo! 49ers defense looking good right now. Keep up the intensity. If you were a Chiefs fan, what would you say the end game score? I already gave a Chiefs score prediction. If they win, I think the score is like 30-19. If the 49ers win, I think the score is 24-20. Oh, yeah, that's going to be awesome. A regulars, I think it's first week opening game is going to be in there in Brazil. Third and 15, Mahomes drops back. He's got time, steps up to the pocket, going to try to run, and he is tackled. Picks up maybe four yards, not nearly enough for a first down, and that is back-to-back. -back. Well, no, that's not three and out. It was four and out. Four and out because first play was that run by Pacheco. Who got to him? Was that Gregory? Did Randy Gregory just tackle Mahomes? Oh, you're welcome, San Francisco. You are welcome. Yeah. Ooh. Niners get blown up on that punt. Caught at the 14. All right. Okay. So, a lot of defense so far, huh? Randy Gregory, now that you're not a Bronco, baby, easily tack tackling Mahomes. 
All right. Now, obviously, I'm still scared that that McCaffrey fumble is going to bite the Niners in the ass. But the way their their defense is playing right now, giving me a tiny bit of hope. Tiny bit of hope. Come to Brazil. Yeah, you could. You might be able to convince Tom to go to Brazil. He'll do that. He'll do that. AFL, not rugby. We have a Texan on our team. Ooh, nice. Oh, yeah, let me look in there. Interesting. Interesting. Thanks for the follow-up, Magpie. Big ups to India for formalizing the number zero. Thank you, India. Edgar Carter, thank you. 3,900 people watching the stream right now. Make sure you like this stream. Oh, well, now it says 4,000. Who knows? Can we get to 2,000 likes before halftime? All right, a lot of defense so far in this game. Don't mind it because, you know, means nobody scored. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Who's the who's the first guy who's going to rip off a big play? The Niners have had some nice chunk plays, but we need we need somebody to break a 40, 50 yard play, okay? All right. Oof. Now we got a Michael Sarah commercial. All right. All right. Kittle, we think Kittle's going to make the first big play? Yeah, that feels right. Kittle for the Niners. I see some Rices for the Chiefs. All right. I think those are both good guesses. That's who I'm going to roll with. That's who I'm going to roll with. What's something the Super Bowl doesn't have anymore that you wish could be brought back? Oh, the like the uh, the Bud Light Bowl. I want the Bud Light Bowl back where the bottles play against each other. My vote would be for the return of the AFC and NFC logos in the respective end zones. It's been nine years. Oh, interesting. I, yeah, I don't think I care enough about that. So I don't think there's like that pride of winning for the whole division like it used to be. When the leagues first merged, like it was a big thing when the AFL, you know, won. All right, here's a run to the left side for McCaffrey. He picks up eight, but we got a flag. Is this going to be on the 49ers? Got another false start? Another Romo saying offside. Who did it? Sam Fran or the Chiefs? Well, they're talking to Kyle Shanahan, so I would say that's the Chiefs. Yeah, it's the Chiefs. Penalties declined because McCaffrey picked up eight yards. Ooh, do you decline it? Do you take a first and five versus a second and two? Huh. Interesting choice. I think I just take the flag there. I think having the first down... Is better than second and short, right? It's like a two yard difference. Nope, yeah. And now it's first and five. Kyle did not want to decline that. Okay. See, I know so I know football a little bit, guys. I know football a little bit. I'm like, is there a strategic advantage of it being second and three versus first and five? All right, handoff here again to McCaffrey. Patient, pops to the left side. He picks up three before he's tackled by a bunch of red jissies. Okay, so we're in the exact same position. We're at second and two. And if it were second and two, that would have been a first down. Maybe Kyle should have went with his gut there. Can't wait for halftime, Lions fan. Hmm. I know. I feel for you, Detroit. I really do. All right, second and two coming up. Play action. Take a deep shot. Ah, 
Chiefs are stacking the box. They're going to hand it off anyway. McCaffrey finds a crease. He picks up a first down. Three-yard pickup. All right. How many carries has McCaffrey had already? I think that's his fifth. It says four here. I think it might be five. All right, first and 10. Showing Mike Shanahan up in the box. Looking good, Mike. Looking good. Quick pass to McCaffrey coming out of the backfield, and he picks up a yard. Karloftis is on the ground. A little slow to get up. Karloftis and Leo, Leo Chanel were all over that play. One-yard pickup. Love your channel, Perna. Broncos are poverty. No, we're very rich, actually. Actually, But in terms of wins, yes, poverty. Incomplete to Debo Samuel here on second and nine. Purdy stepped into the pocket, had Debo, but I don't think he could really get set there to, to make the throw he wanted. Just kind of dirted it. Third and nine. I know what you meant, Jake, but my, my team is rich. We're the richest. Can't take that away from us. Here's 10 bucks. Go Niners. Hell yeah. And now I'm rich. Thank you, guys. Do we get to 2,000 likes? Ooh, we're a couple hundred away. We're almost there. Third and nine. Come on, San Francisco. Come on. Give us a big play. We crave a big play. Purdy, back. Fires, left side. Got a man complete. We got a 49ers first down. Yes. Chris Conley. A revenge catch for Conley. There we go. There we go, Chris. Love it. Purdy just stands tall in that pocket. He has good protection. He, he has good feel for the pocket. Just moves over to the left. Doesn't panic. Doesn't look impressive, but it really is. It's really damn impressive. All right, from the 48. Use check in motion. Purdy drops back. Steps, fires, over the middle. Got a guy again. Who is this? Ray Ray McLeod. That's a big pickup. 19 yards over the middle. Sneed in coverage here. Ooh. You don't see guys going after Sneed. What a perfect throw by McLeod. That wasn't Sneed wasn't in coverage. He just made the tackle. He had to come off back from his wherever he was. All right, there we go. There we go. Now we're moving, Sam Fran. Now we're moving. Now I'm getting a little excited. McCaffrey, or sorry, Purdy goes deep, takes a shot. Ah, oh, fuck. He had Ayuk. But it looks like Ayuk got caught up there or kind of stopped running. I don't know if he would have caught it either way. It looked like he wanted the quick pass to McCaffrey right away. It was not there. Took a shot downfield. Just couldn't connect. Ooh, how much? You can't just say upsetting. You got to give us the, the deets. Oh, yeah. Purdy just overthrows that one. <clears throat> Second and 10. I hope use check scores. Let's get a use check touchdown. Let's root for this, everybody. Hand off to McCaffrey, and he is stuffed in the backfield. No chance. That is a big loss. Four-yard loss. Now we got third and 14 coming up. Damn. Oh, yeah. 68 just missed his guy there. It's unblocked. Oh. Third and 14. Chiefs are making it tough. On the run game. Into the first quarter. Dang, we're already through the first quarter. 0-0. Zero, zero. No score. There's an alternate universe where Kyle Shanahan become the Broncos head coach instead of the 49ers. Yes, there was one. He interviewed for the job. He did very well. And then uh, Joe Ellis and John Elway decided not to, to hire him. God, it's a big what if. Probably, maybe, what if they, they, what if Kyle Shanahan could have had Josh Allen? 
Will this be the new 23rd worst game ever and it still be a loss for the Broncos? <laughs> Maybe. We'll see how this game shakes out. And then I'll de determine whether we're doing the real winners and losers of the Super Bowl or the new worst game ever. CBS's new HUD looks cheap using basic impact font. I mean, I think impact's like just recommended to you right when you open up like a Adobe After Effects. It's like the default font. And yes, we got a Christopher Watkin commercial. Ushers at the table. Wow. Lots happening in this. <clears throat> Already losing my voice. It's not good. We're one quarter in to the Super Bowl. Like a good neighbor. That was Schwarzenegger. He's on a commercial right now. I didn't just say that for no reason. All right. Do we get 2,000 likes already? Ooh, 1,853 likes. Let's get to 2,000. Come on. It's the year 2,000 and above. All right. Oof, third and 14. I think we're going to, I think the Niners are going to pick up like seven yards here. And we're going to get a, a Jake Moody field goal attempt. Got to get some points. Got to get some points. Or let's run a double reverse, Kyle. Double reverse throw. So you get Debo coming in on the jet sweep. It's a handoff to Debo. <clears throat> but then McCaffrey comes, lined up wide. Takes it, and we all know McCaffrey can throw. Rolls out to his left. Fires a touchdown to Kittle or Purdy. John Elway caught a, a pass in the Super Bowl. Let's do a throwback, San Fran. Let's do a throwback. All right, come on. Back on the field. Thank you for streaming, Brandon. Sick in bed and enjoying your thoughts in the chat. Hell yeah. Mr. Q, sorry you're sick. Get better. Take some vitamins. Drink your fluids. And um, hold on. Third and 14. Purdy, pressure in his face, steps through it. End zone. Oh, incomplete. Coverage was tight on Debo Samuel. But the way Purdy just stepped up through that pressure was nice. That was McDuffie in coverage. Fuck, that was just perfect coverage. Kind of gets his hand there. There's a little bit of an arm bar. He got his hand locked. Mm, they're going to let him play. They're going to let him play. I see a little bit of an arm grab there. I'm not going to lie. All right. So Moody's kicking a field goal anyway. 55 yarder. Would have liked some yards there to make it an easier kick. But. He's good from 55. There you go, Jake. Mm. There you go, Jake. Hell yeah. That's a big kick for a rookie kicker. Who's missed a few kicks this year. Fuck yeah. We'll take it. Three nothing. This sucks. I want to watch the Nickelodeon version, but I'm in Canada. They don't have the Nickelodeon version in Canada? Interesting. I'm so drowned in cheese and beer that anything happens on this game, I will be happy. I also downed a bunch of cheese right before I came and did this stream. Some uh, English cheddar. $100 on first touchdown and then another 100 on a parlay of Kelsey anytime TD. Chiefs win and the under. Okay, well, your use check, your use check dream is still alive. No touchdowns been scored. So, oh my God, are they making a twister too?
Twisters. Oh, I didn't know they were making Twisters. Twister 2. Wow. I'm genuinely surprised. Do you guys know how big that movie was when it came out? Twister was huge. Took the world by storm. Now we get Twisters 20 years later. No, it's longer than that. It's like 30 years later. Oh, fuck. I'm getting old. Twisters. All right. All right. Now, I don't want to surprise uh, or spoil it, but before the game started, Jess told me to say something crazy that would happen in the Super Bowl. And I said the craziest thing that could happen would be Jake Moody making like five or six field goals and winning Super Bowl MVP. We are on that path. We are currently on that path. You should do a top five commercials at end of game. Uh, that's a great idea, but I would have to watch all the commercials and I have to think about the commercials after the game after streaming for four hours, and I'm not Tom Grassi, so I will not do that. I'll be writing the recap of either new worst or winners and losers. I'll be focused on other things. Holy crap, I saw Twister for the first time on VH in my grandpa's house on an old-ass wooden TV. I might have seen that at a drive-in, honestly. I can't remember. I feel like I saw it at the theater, though. If the Niners win, I begin my quest to have 10 children like Philip Rivers by Super Bowl 69. Awesome. Are you married? This is like plan feasible. Or do you got to find the girl still? How realistic is this? That's all I want to know. Audio listener here. Twister, the game. <laughs> no, the movie Twister about tornadoes. About tornadoes. Where's Tom? He got something better. I don't know. I just haven't seen him all day. He's been radio silence. Radio silence. All right. First and 10 for the Kansas City Chiefs from the 25. A little play action from Mahomes. Dumps it off to Pacheco. And he's going to pick up, I don't know, seven yards for being pushed out of bounds. Isn't Shark... <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah, Sharknado, the Twister sequel. Yes, Tom is actually at the game. Super Bowl of green chili for you. You know what? I got frozen green chili in the freezer, but I don't think that's on the menu today. It was like two weeks ago. I ate green chili, I swear to God, every night for a week. Where's the curse wheel going to attack Moody? I don't know. Or win. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Moody got cursed. All right. Pacheco handoff. Ooh, bulldozes his way. Just shy of the first down, so we got a third and short coming up. Yeah, I don't know. So far, Moody is – maybe it was a blessing. Well, look, if he's got to kick the game winner, I don't feel good about it. Okay, third and one. Third and one. Mahomes under center. Hands it off. Kind of like a weird little – Right side run there by Rice. He fumbled, but of course the Chiefs recover. Of course they recover. Was he down? Let me see. Was this an actual fumble? Let's see here. Oh, no, that's a fumble. God, they can't catch a break. They can't catch a break. It went right to Noah Gray. The ball went right to Noah Gray. Good God. Oh, my God. Mahomes deep. McCole Hardman catches it. What the fuck? This is a 50-yard throw.
My God, the what was Gibson doing to Sean? You had that. You had the angle, the spot. Oh, you could have picked that off too. What the hell? 53 yards. The Chiefs are on the nine yard line. Yeah, it was when you saw the drive and go up. That's why I think I was there. Hand off Pacheco left side. He fumbles. He fumbles. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Hargrave recovers. 49ers ball. God, that's huge. Who popped that out there? Is that Lenore? Yeah, Lenore rips it out. Fuck yes. All right. Oh, look at that picture of you and Tom. Yeah, I guess I do want the Chiefs to lose. <laughs> Trying to keep my composure, but uh, that one got me. All right. <clears throat> That's kind of wild. McCaffrey fumbled. Pacheco fumbled. You don't see those dudes make mistakes. Rice fumbled two plays earlier, but it bounced right back to Noah Gray. Mahomes hits a 53-yard bomb, and then that drive ends. A lot of mistakes by the guys who shouldn't be fucking making them. This goes to show you, Super Bowl, man. People get jittery. <clears throat> All right. All right. 4,700 people in this silly stream. Did we break 2,000 likes? Yes, we did. Hell yeah. I appreciate you guys watching along with me. Make sure you subscribe here if you haven't already. How many subs do I got? <clears throat> 560. Wait, hold on. I got to update this. 564,018. And 18. We hit 564. That's crazy. But I want more. It's never enough. It's never enough. There will never be enough subscribers. But YouTube is a... It's a lose-lose. As soon as you get to one number, you just want another one. I think that's called the greed. Dude, you're a Broncos fan. If anyone have the free pass to hate on the Chiefs, it's you. Thank you, Edward. Yeah, who greased the balls? That's a good question, Jason. Wait, are you Mike McDaniel's brother? Do you coach the Saints? Yeah, who greased these balls? Mm, that was huge because I thought the Chiefs were just going to – I thought they were going to walk in for a touchdown after that 53-yard bomb. Mm. I think they just said the first time two starting running backs each fumbled in the first half. All right, Purdy rolls out. He's got nobody around him. He takes off running. He's tackled, and he's going to be two yards shy, and then there's a flag. What's that flag? A little late shove in there? Ooh, horse collar. They got him around the neck. That's 15 yards after the end of the run. Yeah, let's see. Brock. Yeah, he does. He got him back of the jersey there. There we go. We'll take those extra 15 yards. Hell yeah, Edward. Edward, you've been killing, killing this chat. All the way from Brazil, dropping 
Supers, now you're a member. I love you, Edward. Brandon, God bless you. I love you too, Dan. Hold on, I gotta watch this play. From the 32. A pitch? Is that Debo back there? Yeah, he's gonna pick up one. One yard. God bless you. There's a, an internet out. A, there's an internet outage in my area of Arizona, and you are my only outlet to the happenings in the Super Bowl. Rock effing on. Oh, man. I'll try to not let you down. Whoa. Kelsey was yelling at Andy Reid. Again, his face. Weird. Handoff here on second and nine. McCaffrey gets one. All right. So the Niners had some runs early on, but now they're having a lot less success running the football. All right. Chiefs getting angry. I don't know if that's going to be good or bad. Are they going to lose their cool? We had deflate gate. Now we got grease gate. That's right. Them balls are greased. Lose your composure, Kansas City. Third and eight for the Niners. This is a big one. Come on, convert. Purdy's got to throw it here. Chiefs, bring some dudes. Purdy shifts, moves, fight, sacked. Mm, he tried. He tried to get away from it. Chiefs brought the heat. Niners couldn't hold up long enough. How many guys did they bring? One, two, three, four, five. Is it just five? Yeah, just five guys, but Niners couldn't hold them. Justin Reed spied on Purdy there. He did a good job bringing him down. Fourth and 13. But the fact that the Niners didn't give up any points there is a freaking miracle. All right, here we go. Punt is off. That's a good punt to the 20. Oh, it bobbled. It's bobbled, but pick back up. Oh, this game is sloppy. No return. No return. Tom was drunk AF with a bunch of strippers before the game. Duh, radio silence. Just kidding. More duo casts with Guillermo Yaves next season. Well... I think so. I mean, Will and I do a podcast basically once a week over on the That's Good Broncos channel, but I've been thinking about just doing those podcasts Sunday after the Broncos game with Will. He'll be happy you said that, and I'll let him know. Can you oil yourself up if the Chiefs win? I mean, that seems like a pretty good reason to oil oneself up. But then they, then I got to take a shower. Maybe we'll see. There's a scene in Twister where a tornado destroys a drive-in theater. Are you sure you aren't thinking of that? No, I know the scene, and I'm pretty sure like we were watching it at the drive-in. We used to go there, not like a lot when I was a kid, but a fair amount of times. I saw Batman Forever at the drive-in. I saw Forrest Gump at the drive-in, and I feel like I saw Twister there too. And like thinking like, oh my God, this is really scary because we're at a drive-in watching it. But I maybe I'm remembering it wrong. I don't know. Really shouldn't be grabbing your coach and yelling at him. Yeah, it's like a weird thing to do. Kelsey loses his cool though. Like that's nothing new. But to do it to Andy in the Super Bowl? Come on, Travis. Come on, Travis. Your girlfriend's watching. She doesn't want to see a man who can't keep his temper under control. That's a red flag, Taylor. That's a red flag. Not to be confused with the red flags that the Chiefs just raised because that's their colors. It's a relationship red flag. Let's see. Do they, <clears throat> Let's see, they got Kelsey yelling.
Okay. <clears throat> Trying to catch my voice here. We've got... Do you think there's going to be more fumbles in this game? Can we set the record for most fumbles in a Super Bowl? Oh, did McCaffrey get roasted by Patrick Starr for the fumble? Hmm. Not going to like that if that sticks. Not going to like that if it sticks. Oh, my God. Did Drake Greenlaw hurt his knee trying to run out onto the field? Holy shit. Did he just... What the fuck? Did he just... That is the, that is the worst. That is the worst way to get injured. I feel that is terrible. Just trying to run onto the field, dude. Did he pull his hamstring there? What the fuck? You don't want to see that? Oh, God. Can we start the rumor Swift is cheating with Reed and that's why Kelsey was mad at him? There's 5,000 of us in here. That's enough to start one. That is enough. That's definitely enough. They're bringing the card over for Greenlaw? Oh, fuck. Oh, God, no. He's an important part of their defense. All right, Mahomes here on first and 10. He avoids a sack. He's scrambling, and now he just throws the ball out of bounds. I don't think he gets back to the line of scrimmage. That's got to be grounding, right? Yeah, that's grounding. He didn't get back to the line of scrimmage. Yeah. God, this game is ugly. <laughs> I mean, there's time. We're only you know, six minutes into the second quarter, but I expected a much more fundamentally sound game. Curse wheel season recap video, please. Oh, interesting. Maybe. 10 yard penalty. So we got second and 20, 25, 20. Yeah, he's outside of the the pocket or whatever. But you got to get it past the line of scrimmage. So that's why it's a penalty. Did not get it past. Seeing all this scrubs, seeing all these scrubs returning punt this week, Devin Hester have been enshrined in the Hall of Fame is unsettling. <laughs> Hester's like, I could still do a better return job. And I'm however many years old. <laughs> Travis yells at Andy in the Super Bowl. Travis yells at Andy between the fumbles. All right, handoff here to Pacheco on second and 20. He's going to pick up five. So Greenlaw's going to the locker room. He either injured his knee or his hamstring. Lower left leg injury is the word, but it doesn't look like he's coming back. And that's a key piece to the 49ers defense. And he was, I'm, I don't know if you saw it. He was just trying to run onto the field and he hurt his leg. Mahomes, oh, nearly a sacked. And then he's brought down. I don't think it's going to count as a sack, but they get him. Eric Armstead finally puts his arm around Mahomes' legs and we got a punt coming for the Chiefs. Feels like there's going to be something terrible that happens on this punt. Either a muff or the Chiefs botch the snap and we get a safety. That's my prediction. That's the way this game feels right now. Punt is off. 
So, nope, no safety. Caught at the 33. Little, little action after the play. Guys going at it. No flag. Okay, sorry, just checking Twitter real quick. Okay, we good. We good. I knew you would fumble when you walked. <laughs> I knew you would. Fu I don't. I don't even know. I knew you were trouble when you walked in. I knew you would fumble when you walked in. I can't. I can't hear the rhythm in my head. I knew you were fumbling when you. I knew you'd fumble when you walked in. It's close. That's pretty close. That's probably perfect, actually. Nobody clipped that. Yeah. Yeah, so far, this is a really weird Super Bowl. It's feeling like a new worst Super Bowl ever. I swear to God, if... If the Niners just win this game three to zero, then we could truly be watching the worst Super Bowl that's ever been played. Yeah, he might, maybe it's his Achilles. They're saying for Dre Greenlaw. I just retweeted the uh, the clip of him going down, so I retweeted that. If you want to see it, it's just he was jumping up and down. Oh, is that his left leg? Yeah, that might be his Achilles. Fuck. Is that another Achilles injury? Ooh. Yeah, you see his, like, cap pop. Fudge. Fudge. As a football player, like, that's the last way you want to leave a football game. Like, if you get hurt making a play, during a play, it's like, yeah, it, it happens. But just running out on the field, oof. That's some cursed-ass shit. This is a curse. As a Chargers fan in Arizona, I'm also rooting for fellow Arizona native Brock Purdy from Queen Creek, Arizona, beat the Chiefs. Come on, Purdy. We believe in you, Purdy. Broncos' best helmet behind you, navy blue, is yeah. This helmet's this is should this should be it. Easy, easy fix. Fun fact, if the Niners win, Sam Darnold will be the first QB from the 2018 draft class to win a ring. That's right. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> you got Baker, you got Lamar, you got Josh Allen, Darnold. Of course, Rosen went in that one. Game is boring. 3-0, almost halftime. I agree. I don't know if it's not. It's there's been fumbles, a crazy injury. I don't know if it's boring. It's not good. All right, Purdy steps into the pocket, dumps it off, incomplete to Debo, in and out of his hands. Kind of a wonky throw, but I think Debo should have caught that one. This game is dumb, but I'm not bored. We ride and we die. Together. Yeah, I'm not bored either. It's bad football, but it's not boring yet. All right. The Chiefs have taken the run away from the Niners. And I don't want the 49ers to abandon the run, but Purdy needs to make a play with his arm. Over the middle, got Debo this time. It's good enough for a first down. That's a 12-yard pickup. There we go. Get that first down. Now you can run it, San Fran. Final score three to oh Edgar. That would be that would be the perfect, perfect game for me. Niners win three to two in the most embarrassing Super Bowl of all time. Edgar is a Chargers fan, right? You're a Chargers guy, right, Edgar? Yeah. We can both root for that. Alfonso Soriano broke his ankle during the same hop after he hit a home run with the Cubs. At least he hit the dinger. Play action. Purdy looking. 
dumps it off to McCaffrey, and he's tackled awkwardly. His knee bends back, but he picks up six. He bounces up. He's fine. I feel the NFL script writers have the 49ers leading by 10, so Mahomes, so Mahomes can mount a comeback on the second half. Yeah, they had a 10-point lead the last time and lost. Yeah. McCaffrey tackled awkward as hell there. He grimaces. It's easy if he's in the backfield. Did he come off for a play? No, he's, he's still there. Hand off to McCaffrey again, and he fights his ass forward, picks up six. First down, San Fran. That's back-to-back -back firsts. All right, come on. Come on, 49ers. Put it. Let's get a touchdown going. The last two games, the 49ers have played terrible in the first half. They've been trailing massively. If they can have a lead going into halftime, that's a much better spot to be in for this team who I think hopefully can close it out. Who knows? What does that mean? It doesn't mean anything. Those are games that already happened. They're irrelevant now. All right, from the 44, Mitchell. They bring in Mitchell. He squirts forward for eight yards, seven yards. What'd you get there, Mitchell? Second and three. <laughs> One of my favorite Twitter accounts, art but make it sports. The mocking of Christ is the art. <laughs> Kelsey. <laughs> Yelling at Andy Reid. That is perfect. Sorry, Perna, pulling for the Chiefs tonight. That's all right, Jaster. Only because I'm a Seahawks fan. I get it. Pitch here, Mitchell. He's looking for some room, but he's going to get tackled after about maybe one. So we got a third and two coming up. And then we got a flag. Sneed got in Ayuk's face. Who's this on? Looks like the way Ayuk was acting, it's going to be on the Chiefs. Yeah, it's on the Chiefs. <laughs> Suck it. We got a horse collar on the Chiefs. And now we got a personal foul after the play. Chiefs are just losing their cool. Ooh, Ayuk, Ayuk gave Sneed a little tug on his jersey, and then Sneed slapped him in the face. You can't do that, Legarius. Yeah, you can't slap a dude in the face, even if he is wearing a helmet, and it doesn't hurt him literally at all. You can't do it. This game is ugly and weird. I'm kind of digging it. All right, 441 from the 21. Fresh set of downs after the Chiefs penalty. They got like 10 guys at the line of scrimmage. Purdy, quick pass. Incomplete. Debo wants a flag. Not going to get one. I thought Sneed might have been on him early too, but it was bang, bang. Let's see. Is he there early? Is he on him? Ooh, Purdy took a shot there. Damn. Bolton hit Purdy. I'm trying to see if Sneed was on Debo. Yeah. Some fighting. Within five yards, but I don't know. As a Packers fan, I can't root for either team. Just rooting for turnovers. Let's go pick six. I want a Niners uh, defense to get a pick six. Second and ten. Uh-oh. To Jennings. Back to McCaffrey. We got some trickery. McCaffrey, touchdown. Oh, Purdy throws it to Jennings. Jennings back to McCaffrey, and McCaffrey scores. We finally got a crazy-ass play. That worked for a touchdown. There you go, San Francisco. Oh, shit, that is crazy. Woo. Quick pass. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. That is a thing of absolute beauty.
Moody is good on the PAT, which he was nearly perfect this year. I think he was 60 of 61 on point after attempts. 10-0 lead Niners. Oh, God. That was a good touchdown. That was an awesome Super Bowl touchdown. Lions fan in Kansas, let's be honest, how much more fun would this game be if the Lions were in it? Well, after this play, <laughs> the timing of me reading this, Kristen and Jeff, is bad because that was awesome. But I agree. Where in Kansas are you? Your live cast is more than a minute ahead of CBS. Well, where are you at? What's a SEK? I'm behind a lot of people. There's no way to ever sync this stuff up is what I've learned. Yeah, this game's getting fun. It's ugly. It's weird. We just had a trick play touchdown. I'm not even going to say how this game could be perfect because I don't want to jinx it. Niners are up by 10. Chiefs got them right where they want them. We'll see. 10 points for the Chiefs, that's easy to overcome. I, I agree. The Niners have been up 10 on the Chiefs before in the Super Bowl. But the Niners have fought through deficits this postseason. The Chiefs really haven't had to deal with that yet. I forget exactly who scored first in the Bills game. I don't think there's ever a 10-point deficit, though. And if we can just get one more Niners defensive stop, they're getting to Mahomes. Their coverage is tight. He has nowhere to go with the ball. Outside of that one big play. Mm, Niners defense been good. And yeah, that, that play call, man, that takes guts for Shanahan to call that there. <laughs> Double pass. Oh, Jennings to McCaffrey for the touchdown. Oh, man. I bet there's a lot of people had Mahomes or Purdy for first touchdown pass of the game. Yeah, who, who is there one lucky person who bet on Jawan Jennings to have the first touchdown pass of the game? If there is, that guy's inside, inside better. Because only Kyle Shanahan probably knew about that play. <laughs> Rooting for Casey because I don't want 49ers to get their sixth Super Bowl ring before the Steelers get a seventh. Hoping Tom and Johnny are having an incredible time. I bet they are. Oh, thank you, Janine. The Shogun series going to be so good. And this, wait, this is the ad I'm excited about. Sorry, I missed it. I missed it. I'm out of the loop. Stuck at DIA since I need to travel for work. Prayed to Blucifer for a San Francisco win. Thank you, Michael. That's the real, the real deity to pray to is Blucifer. Run left side here for Pacheco. Running hard, he's going to pick up eight, maybe nine yards. A little more chippiness between everybody. Do they give him nine here or eight? They're going to give him eight. Guess Kyle didn't lose his playbook this time. Yeah. That was a hilarious storyline from the Falcons Patriot Super Bowl. Kyle Shanahan lost his playbook. That was that Super Bowl, right? It wasn't his, his Niners one. All right, second and two. From the 33. Hand off. Pacheco. He's going to pick it up. And about four more. I'm a Raiders fan. Quite salty because one of our two biggest rivals will win the Super Bowl in our new stadium before we do. Yeah. The chances of the Raiders winning in that stadium, though, that's pretty tough. But, yeah, this is a nightmare matchup to host for the Raiders, for sure. 5,000 people watching. Thank you guys so much. Can we get to 3,000 likes before halftime? 
All right. Mahomes looking to pass. Dumps it off to Pacheco. Caught. Picks up six. Tackled by Fred Warner. Ooh. You sent that well before the play. It was a great play for sure. We're in Wichita in the slow works of moving to Colorado. Well, I lived in Wichita for six years, so good luck on getting back here. It was my priority as well. All right, second and four. Chiefs, can they put together a drive before halftime here? Hand off, Clyde edwards a He's going to be tackled behind the line of scrimmage. Loss of a yard. You got Warner. You got Bosa. You got Gregory over there. Third and five. Oh, come on. Hold them. Hold them, SF. Yeah, Warner just blows his shit up. So fast. Bosa gets to him first. But I think Warner getting there, there was no lane for Clyde Edwards to get to. All right, we got the two-minute warning. What are the Chiefs going to do here? Both teams have all three timeouts. So if the 49ers can just get a stop, plenty of time to work with to get some more points before half. <clears throat> they need to get a, a larger lead than 10 points. We know that. Please pray for Kansas City field goal. 250 in the bag. As long as that field goal doesn't give them the lead, Elliot, and they don't win, I will pray for that. Uh, no update on Greenlaw yet. Uh, he's in the locker room. I'm not a doctor, but I don't think he's coming back in the game. And if you looked at the video, uh, on Twitter, it looked like his calf popped, right? We saw that with Rogers. We saw it with Kirk Cousins. Didn't see a zoomed in version of it, but I look kind of like Achilles. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm not watching the halftime show because I don't care. Here's a tenor for incentive for you to strip act at half. You know, for all the ladies in your audience, all three of them watching. Yeah, I don't. Well, I'll get carried away. I won't stop. And then the video will get I'll get blocked, and banned by YouTube. I don't think I can do that, Rico. But I appreciate where your head's at. Really do. All right. Oh, boy. Ah, oh, Taylor Swift drinking beers. They got beers being slammed by Taylor. If that doesn't win win people over, I don't know what will. What's more football than that? Got Swift slamming beers? Whew. Yeah, I mean, that's what it looks like based on visual information and we've seen it multiple times this year so we know what it looks like but we don't know they gotta look in there with the machine an mri machine so we really know let's see here did ian rapaport tweet anything out about it yeah, Rappaport said Achilles injury. So, yeah, that sucks. That sucks. He's not coming back. That's not coming back. It's not a surprise. When you go down immediately like that and nobody touches you, it's usually bad. It's usually the worst case scenario every time. We got a couple ladies watching. Hell yeah. Oh, do we get a false start by the Chiefs? Yes, we did. Third and five, and we got a false start from Kansas City. Oh, God. That could be big. So now we got third and ten. 
That is less manageable. They're going to call it third and nine on the TV. Mahomes can easily pick up nine yards. I don't think that's actually that huge from Patty. But what about the rest of the dudes? Can they get pressure? Bosa falls down. Mahomes rolling across the middle. Finds Noah Gray. And he's got a first down. Not Travis Kelsey. But there's another flag. Do we got to hold? Come on. Chiefs line. Chiefs line holding. Come on. Nope. It's going to be on the Niners. It's holding San Francisco. Penalties declined. Damn it. They announced it. Okay. Well, I can't really hear the TV, so thank you. Turn it up to volume, so maybe I can hear. Show the rest of us that your diet of salads and shrimps actually works. <laughs> oh, my good job. Uh, hmm. There you go. That's a shrimp arm. First and 10. Mahomes steps up. Got in and out of Noah Gray's hands. Had him, too. <clears throat> Where the fuck's Travis Kelsey? I'm going to be honest, Edward. Uh, after dinner, that's when I get in trouble. Then I go to the sweets. Then I go to the scotch. I'm in pretty good shape. But if I were a little more disciplined, maybe I could almost have abs. Taylor Swift slamming beers is not a sentence I thought I'd hear. She's slamming them. Tay-Tay slamming those beers. Second and 10 from the 39. Mahomes, quick pass, dumps it off to Pacheco. He's got some room, and he's going to pick up seven? Yeah, about seven. At the half on my channel... Rams, 49ers, Tecmo style. Retro reviews, nice. I love that. I love that aesthetic. Who roasts your coffee? Also drinking scotch. We roast them in Lincoln, Lincoln, Nebraska. Quick pass, Mahomes to Reishi Rice. He picks up a first down. Chiefs are moving. They're in their hurry up right now. This is working for them. Niners sucking some air. That's Lenore in coverage. Oh, he passes it off there. Quick pass. Need the Chiefs to make another mistake at the third and 25. Quick pass to Rice again. He's going to pick up 11 before getting tackled by Fred Warner. One minute left. Chiefs have all three timeouts, so there's no need to rush. Reed talking to somebody. Okay. We got a timeout here? We got a timeout here. 84 is Watson, not Gray. Oh, Justin Watson? Okay, thanks for correcting me. What number is Gray? Thank you for correcting me. I would have continued to sound like an idiot. Wide receivers should not be allowed to wear number 84, by the way. That's confusing to me. All tight ends wear 84 in my eyes. Here, I can find this out, can I? No, not there. I know somebody's giving me the answer already. 83. Noah Gray's 83. Blake Bell, 81. Okay. Thanks, David. <laughs> I would have done that maybe for the rest of my life if you hadn't said that, David. <laughs> Three years into it, I've just been calling Justin Watson Noah Gray. Oh. Yeah, Randy Moss was... Was allowed to wear 84. Okay, yeah. Is Kelsey benched? I'd be ballsy of Andy Reid to just keep him on the bench. You don't push me. 
girl here came on TV and Perna on my game on TV. Girl. God damn it. Game on TV and Perna on my phone, just like every other Sunday. Thank you. Say what? <laughs> what was I saying? There have been six teams to give up a 10 plus point lead in the Super Bowl. Kyle Shanahan is 0 and 2 in such games as head coach or OC. Mahomes 2 and 0 in such games. Yeah. I don't think we can really blame when Shanahan was OC, you know? We can blame the offense for maybe not eating some clock in that second half. It was a defense that gave up all those points, right? That's a good stat, though, Thomas. It's a good stat. Let's see Kyle hold on to it. Kyle Shanahan does not want to be known as the guy who gets 10-point leads in Super Bowls and can't hold on to them. All right, Kelsey's back out there. He's officially not on the bench, guys. One oh nine. So the Chiefs get the ball after halftime too. Come on, throw a pick. Throw a pick. Quick pass to Rasheed Rice. Ain't gonna get a pick there. He's gonna pick up four, maybe three. Depends on where they spot this. It's hard to tell. Call it three. Second and seven. <clears throat> Less than a minute left. Chiefs do have two timeouts. There are not too much of a rush here. What are they doing? I think they're just going to milk this clock. Make sure the 49ers get no chance. They got to take a shot to the end zone here. Handoff. Rice. He picks up two or three. Okay. I don't know why you wouldn't be giving it to Pacheco down here. Like the misdirection or something. All right. So third and five. They just used their second timeout. There is 31 seconds left. Watson is also who caught the fumble earlier. Yeah, I know. I've been saying him wrong the whole time. I've been calling him Noah Gray the whole time. 50 shades of Noah Gray. Again, I would have never learned. As a Panthers fan, it's crazy to see so many points. <laughs> nice. It's hilarious, Steve. All right. 31 seconds after this timeout. Third and five. Niners going to get him to settle for a field goal here? Come on. Let's see. Come on, Bosa. Get to him. Taylor's locking arms. Got arms around shoulders. Got a bunch set on the right side, looking for confusion. Mahomes tries to jump pass, and then he gets lit up. Oh, he took a hit. Was that Armstead? Yeah, baby. Eric Armstead again. That's the second time he's tackled Mahomes in this game. Mahomes went to do a jump pass, didn't like it. Pulled it back in, and then Armstead just rocked him. And not like you gently rock a baby, guys. He fucked him up. Whew. Huh. Usually you just see Mahomes do the jump pass. I As soon as Mahomes left the ground, in my head, I was like, he's going to score. Didn't work out. Butker comes onto the uh, field. This is a chip shot. But San Francisco defense holding tight. Then we got a long-ass halftime coming up. 20 minutes. 25 minutes, however long these are. 28-yarder for Butker. One time I talked to McManus about kicking. Um, he said he the short ones made him more nervous in big games than long ones. So you never know. Niners just took a timeout to, you know, make Butker think about this. Butker's too good, though. It is down the gooch, and we got a 10-7 ball or 10-3 ball game. Mahomes chewing on his mouthpiece like Steph Curry. 20 seconds for the Niners here. Think Kyle Shanahan gonna do something crazy? Take a shot. Come on, just get a quick pass to Kittle. See what happens. 
quick pass to Kittle. Let's see what happens. All right, waiting for this kick to get set up here. <clears throat> Can just please, please make the kick. 20 seconds left in this half. I need to pee. Dragging it out. Well, that first half was something, huh, guys? <laughs> One of the most bizarre first halves of a Super Bowl I feel like we've seen in a while. Will be a touchback. So, full 20 seconds for the Niners. I don't think they're going to do anything here. <clears throat> but you never know. Obviously, the risk is a mistake. Cost not just to give the Chiefs points. But after, after Shanahan did a double pass for a touchdown, anything's possible. Was that god-awful pump fake the receiver's Fault two Chiefs fans. <laughs> All right, looks like they're going to run a play. Probably just a handoff. Is a handoff. McCaffrey, who picks up uh, seven, eight, and more fighting after the play. And there's a Chief down. And there's more fighting. There's more fighting. These guys hate each other. This time's Chris Jones and Banks. We know what Chiefs fans do with Banks, too, guys. I would not get into this. Okay, so no timeout. We do have halftime. The whistle was for the fighting, not a timeout. 10-3. 10-3. How many people we got watching? 5,000. Well, I'm going to go urinate. Not on a tree. Let's raid tree. Tree streaming, I believe. Let's raid tree. Let's raid coal. Raid them both while I go to the bathroom. Nothing interesting going to happen when I'm in the bathroom. Come on. Where's tree? Where's tree? Well, here's coal stream. Let me link coal stream. Let's raid coal. Go give those guys the likes. All right. And then let's raid tree. Let's raid tree. Let's raid urinating tree and coal. All right. Those should be posted. I posted links to both guys. I'm going to go to the bathroom, show them some love. See if we can get up to, I don't know, five, six, 100. Don't fuck with me when I'm gone. Oh, he's peeing too. Tree's peeing too.
All right, we're back. We are back. All right. Oh, uh, we getting a reverse raid? We getting a reverse raid? Is that a hemi pillow? <laughs> I wish. Just for back support. Back support. Look at that. Raid for raid. Not a hemi pillow. You know, it just puts a little pressure right where I need it. Everybody can laugh. Go ahead, laugh at my stupid pillow. Since I put this pillow right there, back hasn't gone out. Also, since I've been biking. Bike, back pillow, no back problems. Boom. All right, we're about to get a long halftime show. Got 20 minutes to kill. Thank you for the reverse raid tree. I hope everybody raid a tree while he was in the bathroom, while I was in the bathroom. Hit those likes. <clears throat> Need a little honey for my voice, you know? Oof. So far, this feels like this. I don't think the Super Bowl has been bad. It's been ugly. It's been sloppy. But working, looking for the script for the recap tomorrow, it's feeling a little bit like a new worst Super Bowl, isn't it? Guess we'll see. We'll see. How's the weather out there? I'm driving out on Friday for a week. Hope it snows. Well, we just got some snow, but it's going to be nice this week. Lots of sun. Maybe snow Friday. I don't know. Are you going to be in Denver? Because it's going to be sunny and cold. Well, actually, it's going to be like 49. All right, I got. I might have missed some supers. Let me regroup. Let me regroup. Okay. Are the good guys winning? Actually, right now they are. Bam. Got it. Josh, what's up, dude? 49ers, we have to finish the story. Please, please do, 49ers. Close it out. We want a live audio narration from all Usher songs and dancing. <laughs> You're in the wrong place. I could, I don't know Usher. I know, like, when I hear the songs, I'll be like, oh, yeah, that's Usher. Oh, yeah, but I don't know him. Couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. For chair. Thank you. Oh, yeah. You'll be golden in golden, Josh. Golden's awesome. Golden is awesome. Cute. You can walk around. Restaurants, bars, go to the Coors Brewery, right at the base of the mountains. You're going to love it in Golden. The 49ers are making it look easy to sack Mahomes. The rest of the NFL better take some notes. Yeah, I think part of that's due to the 49ers secondary right now. He's Mahomes been holding on to the ball, and there hasn't been a lot of there hasn't been room for him to kind of maneuver. And the Niners have been getting to him, but I think it's coverage. I think he's bought himself enough time to make some plays. There's just nowhere to go with it. I think he would be, don't tell him, okay? Don't tell Patrick Mahomes. But I think if he would just take off and run a little more, he'd be having more success. Don't tell Patrick that, okay? Can you narrate Usher? No. I don't know the words. I don't know the words. And I can't even hear my TV. My heater's too loud. I'll try. We'll see. I like how it takes like 15 minutes just to set up the halftime show. <laughs> They're showing Kelsey yelling at Andy Reid again. 
That was crazy. Oh, I should check my underdogs. Am I still alive? I stacked some pickums. I did some scorchers. Oh, man, my biggest one already broke. Well, I picked Pacheco to have more than 19 rushing yards in the first quarter. Dang it. So that one's dead. Other ones are alive. Oh, my Scorcher McCaffrey hit. Justin Reed, tackle assists, good. Kelsey, not looking good. Debo, not looking good. Don't think that one's going to go. This episode's not sponsored by Underdog, but if you want to use my code, that's good over there. You always can. Yep, I did three. I did three pickums. I put like a hundred on each one. Then I forgot to live and enjoy it. Got to, yeah, you got to live and die with those. What do you think of Biden skipping on the interview? Jack, I literally have no idea what you're talking about. I couldn't be more detached from politics right now. I don't even know what that means. But if you listen to Biden talks, probably good. It feels like the Niners have absolutely dominated and they're only up seven. I can't figure out what that means for the second half. Yeah, that's fair, Dave. They've had, I mean, but the Chiefs had an opportunity too, right? Both teams were within striking distance. They both uncharacteristically fumbled the ball away. Um, outside of the Niners scoring on a trick play, both defenses have been pretty good. Um, so I don't know if dominated is the right word, but they've, they've had the edge. Let's just see if they have a, a play better second half. Like they've done all postseason. All right, let's put this back to the box score. Thank you for getting me over 100 there. Usher. Is in an all white uniform. He looks amazing. I don't know this song. Instead of F you Tom Brady, it's F you Patrick today. F Y T B F P T B F M T B F M T B is probably the better one. Yeah, I definitely don't know. I don't know, Usher. I'm sorry. I didn't listen to him. I tried not to listen to Usher's music when I was a teenager. No knock on Usher, okay? I just didn't. It's not my jam, not my thing. I do like that this is out on the field. He's not even on a stage right now. He's just on the football field dancing. Dude, if a player trips over somebody who lost like an earring or a uh, a rhinestone on all these sparkly clothes. That could be some controversy. Whoa, that dude just stood on his head for a second. Lots of lasers out there. But it is on the field. That's kind of an intimate sort of look, right? Probably better for the field, too, to not have a stage out there. There's a mini stage in the end zone, but that's about it. Who's going to be the first guest? Is Bieber really coming out for Usher? Oh, camera went to move. Made a mistake. Camera made a mistake. Oh, now there's a stage. Not going to lie. Usher in that outfit looks like an angel. He looks like an absolute angel. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know any of these songs. I just want to see a guest. Bring out a guest. We got some... Uh... He's got two guys dancing with him. They look like they're from A Clockwork Orange. 
They've got canes and the uh, bowler hat things. I do like his clockwork or orange crew. They got eye makeup too. Something about wanting to make love to you. That's what Usher's saying. <laughs> oh no, Usher got injured too. He was just trying to do a dance move. He did a Dre Greenlaw. Oh, he ain't going to get hurt with those moves. I don't know what he just did with his feet. Oh, we got somebody on piano. It's very classy halftime show. That's all I'm going to say. Is that Alicia Keys on the keys? I think my heart is going to explode. And for the moment, the halftime is boff. Some people are saying it's mid. It's a mid show. It's very sensual. Saying if some people were trying to have intercourse during halftime, this would be the show for it. This would be the show for it. Usher has the opportunity to do the funniest thing possible. Terrence Achilles. Yeah, I don't wish that on him, but that would be... That would be funny. Not for him. Not for all the pain he would go through because of what happened to Drake Greenlaw, which is also not funny, but pairing them together. Grossi did a quick live stream. <laughs> this halftime calling is great. Thank you. Oh, here's an Usher song I know. Let me get a frittata, papata. That one. I know that one. No, I didn't even see him. I didn't even see him streaming. I don't have enough eyes. I don't have enough eyes to be that aware of everything. I hope a bunch of people jumped in there, though. Usher's in the middle of a giant circle. He is sweaty. He is sweaty as hell right now. But he's glistening. Even his sweat is sensual. He is glistening on that stage, ladies and gentlemen. Usher is glistening. Now he's saying, hoo, hoo, hoo. yeah, how hot is it in that stadium? I mean, he has been dancing the whole time. He's been dancing for like five, six straight minutes. That's a cardio workout. But he's pretty ripped. Looks like he does cardio on the reg. He's got one glove on like Michael Jackson, too. Oh, now he's he's making love to the air. He's making love to the air. And now he's taking off clothes. Oh, God. Now he's got his shirt off. And he's in perfect shape. Of course, Usher is. How old is Usher? Did he get his name after 
ushering several weddings. And he's just like, yeah, that's my name. Usher. 45. And now he is glistening shirtless. Now we got some sultry guitar happening. Hmm. He is getting his workout done. Doesn't even have to work out today. <laughs> Why is he melting? <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, we got people on roller skates. We got roller girls. It's a roller derby. Oh, shit. I have never seen roller skates on a Super Bowl halftime show. I ain't talking roller blades. Skates. Oh, now people, there's dudes roller skating doing flips. Are we bringing back roller skating? Are we in the future? In the future is more roller skating? There's a dude wearing a weird mask. Is Usher on fucking roller skates? Oh my God. He is. And he's in some sparkly concoction that looks like a futuristic football uniform. I, I'm not going to lie. I was getting a little bored until Usher came out on roller skates. It was all part of the plan, guys. Oh, uh, we're turning down for what? We're miss we're we're turning down for what? Oh, now it's the other Usher song that was used in all those Kevin James movies. All right. Roller skates was sick. They kind of lulled us, and then they came out with roller skates. And now he's playing all the songs that people dance to. He doesn't have roller skates on anymore. But if he had the shoes that had the roller skate in it right now, and he just started cruising across the stage, that would have been cool. They missed a huge opportunity by not having the shoes with the roller skates in them. There you go. Yeah. See, some people love it. Some people love that late 90s, early 2000s R&B. That's right. We were like, huh? And then we got roller skates. I would honestly watch like a hour and a half long live stream of Usher roller skating. I would donate a lot of super chats to that. Oh my God. Now we got Ludacris. Now we got Luda. And they got a whole band out there, a marching band. Okay. Okay. It's not beating the Super Bowl 2004. Which was that halftime show? Was that Creed? Can't remember. Good thing Usher wasn't changing into leather with him all sweaty. Oh, yeah. That's a friend's reference I, I do remember. Can't get out of those leather pants. So when he uses the baby powder too or whatever in the bathroom, he's like locked in that bathroom. Dude, I want that shirt that Usher has. It's just got two pecs and a six pack on the outside of the shirt. You don't even have to work out if you have that shirt. Everyone just like, oh God, that guy's ripped.
Boom. They did it. They did the halftime show. Usher almost got naked. That's when it picked up. And then he jumped on roller skates and we were all happy. Then we were all happy. I am pro roller skates in the Super Bowl. I'll tell you what. <sighs> David Bakhtiari is roasting JJ Watt's hair right now. That's hilarious. It was a little spiky. A little spiky for an adult man, but whatever. A metal band for the halftime show would be cool. You know, I think every year the halftime should have like a different genre of music. That way nobody's excluded, right? Has Meta did Metallica ever do a halftime show? I feel like Metallica did. Did Metallica do the Super Bowl? Nope, they have not. Felt like I remember them doing it once. Think the 2002 Super Bowl halftime show was the best. See, like the years, I'm not going to, I can't remember. You got to tell me who's doing the show, Bees Knees. You got to say the 2002 Super Bowl halftime show with. Is it Prince? Everybody liked the Prince one. It was fine. Uh, the U2 one was pretty big after 9 11. Um, the Michael Jackson's halftime show was probably the best one. Probably the Michael Jackson one. How does this halftime show affect LeBron's legacy? Well, I think he's not the GOAT based on this halftime show. Lady Gaga. Yeah, Janet Jackson with Timberlake. That one was famous because Janet's nipple popped out. I don't know how good it was. We saw two of Usher's nipples. Dang it. Oh, we're getting the Paramount Plus Creed commercial now. All right. <clears throat> Take me higher. Taylor Swift next year, ha dude. I swear to God, we need a we need Taylor Swift and Eminem. If we could have had the Lions in the Super Bowl, and they just sorry Usher, they canceled Usher, and we just had a battle between Swift and Eminem, that would have been the ultimate halftime show. They should have me thinking about these things. At one point, we had the following Super Bowl performers in a row. The Stones, Prince. Oh, yeah. They had Petty, Springs, and The Who, of course. Then Black Eyed Peas. Yeah, but like when they're... <clears throat> remember, when they did The Stones, they had, well, everybody liked Prince, but Petty, Springsteen, The Who, everybody was just like, they're just placating older dudes who like classic rock. So we were complaining about the genres even then. That's why they switch. They go, we got to get more modern with our performers. Yeah, I don't even remember the Coldplay one. 
I think everybody I think everybody would support a weird owl Super Bowl halftime. Oh yeah, Creed was on Thanksgiving. That's right. It feels like a halftime show. It's so legendary, it feels like a halftime show. That's credit to Creed. It's credit to Creed. I'll give them their their dues. Slaughter to prevail halftime show would be lit. What if they just got lit to do the halftime show? Remember lit? I would have voted for a White Stripes Super Bowl halftime show. Currently, I don't know who I'd want. I don't know who would make the best halftime show. I don't think the music I listen to is ripe for it. Last year's was pretty good. They had everybody. I just remember 50 Cent upside down. Ooh, 50 Cent, 50 cent upside down or R Usher on roller skates. What was better? Hmm. I kind of like Usher on roller skates. Being upside down is very impressive. Sorry, I got a tweet. Who do people want? Who do you got? 50 cent on rollers or 50 cent upside down, Usher on roller skates. Both phenomenal. Seeing Johnny Barks tweeting his view of the show. There you go. There you go, Barks. Give us that footy. Give us that footy. Weird Al puts on Weird Al puts on a great show. I saw him live a year ago, and it was peak white stripes for Detroit since they're local. Ooh, that'd be that would be cool. White stripes and Eminem. And it's an actual like White Stripes reunion. It's just Jack and Meg. And then Eminem comes in and they're, oh, that's the show, John. That's the show. If you could have anybody perform, who would it be? Jimi Hendrix. I'd bring him back from the dead, Evan. And give me Jimmy. And Keith Moon. And Janis Joplin. Perfect. Yeah, I can't. I, I'm not really watching them. They used to be great. People still look forward to them, but I think we leave the Super Bowl feeling a little bit disappointed by them. And I feel like they Super Bowl commercials kind of like obtained a level of success that companies try so hard to outdo it, and a lot of times it just doesn't work. All right, here we go. Third quarter finally coming. 6.45 Mountain Time. Chiefs get the ball to start the second half. All right, yeah, so Chiefs saw them losing their cool quite a bit in that first half. Haven't found the end zone yet, which is a little surprising. I know they haven't been scoring like a ton of points even in their wins. But we'll see. We'll see. First play here. Rice in motion. Pitch out to Pacheco. He fumbles it, and he is dragged down at the 10-yard line. Huge loss. Oh, that is not how they wanted to start that first half. Ball is pitched maybe a little high and outside, but, like, he got to catch that. Pacheco got to get that one. Oh, that is a 12-yard loss. It's the third act. That's right, because of the script writers. All right, second and 22. Come on, San Fran. Keep bringing the heat. Pin them. Pin them. Defensive touchdown. I'm getting greedy. 
Mahomes dumps it off. Is this Noah Gray finally? That is Noah Gray. We got the real Noah Gray, not Justin Watson. All right, so they pick up 10 yards there. Got third and 12. All right, three and out. Come on, San Francisco. The worst thing the Niners could do is after that first play, let the Chiefs march down and score a touchdown. Oh, yeah, I would take Greta in a second. Mahomes back to pass, steps up in the pocket, looking to run. Oh, he picked up. Yes. Yes. Who got that? Jair Brown, the rookie safety. Oh. Now, he threw it downfield. They probably would have punted anyway. Some people will try to tell you this is an arm punt, but this is huge. Warner waiting, waiting for him to run. Mahomes just overthrows Kelsey, or was he looking for who's behind Kelsey? I don't know who he was throwing to. Warner went with Kelsey. Maybe he was looking for MVS. He thought Kelsey was going to do something different. I don't know. That's a turnover, though. That's his first pick this postseason? I don't know. Purdy under pressure. He throws it away. Second and 10. My TV froze. Kind of didn't see what happened. Okay. So San Francisco is at the 40, what, 47? All right. They have to pick up a first down and at least get a field goal here. Come on. Give me another trick play, Kyle. Give me another trick play, Kyle Shanahan. Oh, fuck. False start, Niners. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, these teams. I don't, right now, the way both teams are playing, looks like neither one should be in the Super Bowl. It looks like we should have been watching Ravens Lions right now. That's how bad they've been, mistake wise. Again, it's been entertaining, but. Yeah, third false start for the Niners there. That's not fun. All right, Purdy on second and 15. Dirts it. Nowhere to go. Looking for Debo. It's a wobbly, weird throw. I don't know if he tried to throw it in the dirt there. Stepped into the pocket. Both teams are currently playing like that halftime was just a little too long. All right, come on. Third and 15. Let's get a little high knees here for the 49ers, huh? Oh, make sure that zipper's up. Come on, San Fran. I'm going to give you the high knees. Purdy, rolling, going to take off running. Tackled, doesn't get it. Guess the high knees don't work for the 49ers. So the 49ers literally lost one yard on three plays. Did nothing. Fourth and 11. <clears throat> Put out Sam Darnold for just one play, Kyle. Maybe that'll confuse the Chiefs defense. Okay, so we got a punt coming up. Saw the Chiefs muff a punt earlier. They recovered. Nothing is guaranteed. Oh, perfect. Perfect punt. Conley again, the former Chief, catches it at the two-yard line. He was in the perfect spot. I think that's the third play Conley's made in this game. Is Chris Conley the MVP right now?
He's making plays, Conley. He just needs to catch a touchdown, and he can win the MVP. We got to tweet that. Got to tweet that. Let's get juvenile in the halftime show in NOLA. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, Chiefs fans and Collinsworth, I'll ask again. Was that somehow the receiver's fault too? Boom. Might have been. Just kidding. It was 100% Mahomes' fault. Go Niners. I glanced at Usher's steamy halftime show a couple times to see it was over. You're sexier than him, Perna. Whoa. I'm sexier than Usher? Nobody would have a problem with that, Rico. Man crush away. I am sexier than Usher. Feels good to just say that, Rico. Feels good to just say that. Wow. Everything's turning up, Perna. Whew. All right, come on. So, Casey down at the two. Can we get a safety? We get a Super Bowl safety? Another Pacheco fumble for a Niners defensive touchdown? Congratulations, Brandon, on a great season for That's Good Sports. Go Bills. Hell yeah, Adam. Thank you. Thank you, Adam. No, it's the Bills! <laughs> I just want to live in that moment. I just want to live in that moment forever. Oh. Yeah, more tweets about Greenlaw. Reportedly, possibly tearing his Achilles. That's what it looked like. Horrible. Horrible. Well, some people are saying Conley's MVP right now. Saw some Chiefs fans agree with me on Twitter. At Brandon Perna. That's right. Aussie punter getting it down at the two. Mahomes and shotgun, little play action. Deep shot, left side, overthrows MVS. Out of bounds, second and 10. Mahomes doing this. I don't know what that means, but he does it a lot. I would love to see Perna as a fan of the year, but you're too unhinged for Goodell. Yeah, I don't think I can. I don't think I could ever even qualify for that. I think you got to have some like genuine something genuine to hold on to i don't know if i can do that for a full year you know second and ten quick pass there oh god it's kelsey picking up the first down well they're gonna spot him short some re for some reason man you didn't want to let him get those yards there keep him backed up you know they're gonna be looking for kelsey hmm where does knee go down? I'm Andy Reid probably looking at this, right? Oof. That's going to be closer than when they spotted it. Chiefs are going to snap the ball. It's third and one. They can pick it up, but they are playing the run. Mahomes is going to take a timeout. Yeah, he didn't like the look on the defense there. I think they were going to get stuffed. If they can get that look again, I would play action the run and just take a shot here. You need something, and I don't want to see it, but I feel like that's what's going to happen. What is one realistic thing you want the Broncos to do this offseason? Um, keep Russell Wilson and draft a quarterback at 12 or wherever. I'm talking myself into J.J. McCarthy at 12. 
Like pay Russ to play for two years, draft a guy who needs to kind of sit and marinate for two years and do that. I guess talking Russ into staying would be the tricky part. So third and one, Chiefs use a timeout, right? And they're going to hand it off and not get it. They're denied. They're the second effort there, though. See where the ref marks is down. I think they're going to mark it short. There was a second effort. Did his knee touch? Yeah, it's short. Yeah, because Pacheco was like on the 49ers there. He might have rolled into it, but it I don't know if they would have blown that play dead already. Yeah, he might have rolled over into a first down. But if you want to look at a spot here, you got a challenge. And I haven't seen a second angle to make me want to do that. So Chiefs got a punt from their own end zone. A lot of drives without a touchdown for the Chiefs. Most ever, probably, for them. Caught at the 36 by the Niners. Fair caught. Again, probably could have returned it, but who knows? Playing it safe. Don't mind it. All right, San Fran. Touchdown time. Touchdown time. Ooh. Yeah, I wouldn't have gone for it there. I oh, but you're the Chiefs, man. It's like you feel like you can pick up a half yard. Quarterback sneak. Quarterback sneak. Come on. But in this game, down just one score, just pun it. I mean, the Niners have worse field position right now than they did after that Patrick Mahomes interception, so the Chiefs are in a better spot this drive. Kristen and Jeff, 49.99. Can we get a rah, 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 and maybe add in a wear a diaper? Hope you get the quarterback you want. Do I have that clip in here? Uh, I think I got to switch. Let me switch. Nope. Yep. Hold on. It's going to look like GPS for a second. Where is it? There it is. Wear a diaper. Ra, 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 ra. Wear a diaper. Ra, 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 ra. Wear a diaper. Ra, 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 ra. Wear a diaper. You got it. You asked for it. You got it. <laughs> Thank you, Kristen and Jeff. I love the Santa outfits. Love them. Makes me wish it was Christmas again. Okay. 49ers got a score here. They need a touchdown because right now they are, they're, since that one fumble, they've, They've outplayed the Chiefs, haven't taken advantage of all their opportunities. They need 17 to 3, force the Chiefs to like do something stupid. Close this one out. Close it out. Now I did a I did a short on the lowest scoring Super Bowl, and that was the um Rams uh Patriot Super Bowl, where the Rams won 13 to 3. So if the score stays at 10-3, this could be the lowest scoring Super Bowl ever. Oh, gosh. Golly gee. Show Tom Grassi on the Super Bowl. They got a Bud Light promo, a bunch of dudes drinking Bud Lights. Post Malone. Not just a bunch of dudes. That's Post Malone. Where's Shane Gillis? He should be drinking a Bud Light here. Here's Blake Shelton and Gwen Stefani. LeBron. No doubt would have been a cool halftime show. Lady Gaga. Jay-Z and Beyonce. All right. First and 10. From the 36, officially. 
All right, come on, SF. Make a play. Make a play. Purdy rolling under pressure. Gets away from Jones, just dumps it off to Jennings, and he's going to be tackled for a big loss. You should have thrown that one in the ground. Leo Chanel makes the play. It's an eight-yard loss. Both defenses are playing out of their minds in this game. Chris Jones blew it up first, and then credit Chanel for being right there to stop the pass. Karloftis almost tipped that ball, too. Niners offensive line is playing like shit right now. Chiefs line hasn't been great. All right, second and 18. Brock standing tall, throws, has McCaffrey who falls down. Gets seven. Third and 11. Yeah, that's a good throw by Purdy. Just get that ball out there. I think his arm was hit as he threw it. Oops. I don't know why I accidentally clicked that, but yeah, Aussie punter again. <laughs> Purdy's taking care of the football. He's not doing anything stupid right now, but God, somebody's got to make a play. Get the ball to Kittle. Where's Kittle? There he is. Left side. I know coverage has been good. I know pressure's been relentless. Purdy goes deep. Left sideline, there's some contact on Kittle. No flag, though. Oh, yeah, nothing going. Debo might have been open. But he, oh no, he pulls his hamstring. Does Debo Samuel just drop to the ground? He's grabbing the back of behind his knee. Yeah, it looked like a hamstring. So 49ers without Greenlaw and now possibly Debo Samuel. They need somebody to make a play for them. Good God. I did ask for Kittle. I would have liked him to, I'd like the ball to get to him. We need to get the ball to him. Some quick, fast passes. Get him to Kittle. I don't think McCaffrey's 100% either in this game. Now I'm getting nervous. I was not nervous until this exact moment. I just got the feeling like something's about to happen. Oh, or maybe I'm just cold. I don't know. It's a little chilly in this basement. Something feels off is what I'm saying. Oh, boy. I hope Debo's not. I hope he can go back in. God. Come on. Come on. Both teams are desperately trying to find somebody on their offense to make a play. Yeah, Debo's just running and immediately fell down and grabbed the back of his leg, which is why I would assume hamstring but no he's i don't know is he's grabbing the same area drake greenlaw was it's safe to say already this is the worst super bowl game of the last decade or so is it safe to say uh no it's lowest the score is not good this second half so far has not been fun i liked the first half maybe i'm weird though There have been things happening. Just none of them are super positive. But things have happened. If you like things happening, then the game's been fine. <laughs> Remember when Taylor Swift slammed that beer? Remember when Kelsey grabbed Andy Reid? We had the double pass touchdown. That was tight. That was tight. Yeah, dumb penalties by the Niners, false starts. They've had like three. 
A lot of negative plays. That's a really good point, Jesse. All right, Debo's going to the blue tint. Yeah. Since he's not going to the locker room, that's a little bit positive, I guess. All right. Was Nowski punting? He blasts it. Oh! What a hit by Conley! Conley just destroyed the Chief. Conley's a fucking stud. All of his plays have been these special team plays. Oh! That's one of the best tackle tackles I've ever seen on punt coverage. Takes down Richie James immediately. Wow, what a tackle. Yeah, it's feeling like this. It's feeling like a new worst ever. Feeling like a new worst ever. All right, first and 10. Mahomes gets one to Kelsey. He picks up 11 yards. Easy. First first down to the second half by either team right there. We're eight minutes left, nine minutes left in the third. Go punch that bag, Willem. William. Go punch that bag. What football team is that? What football team you play for, William? Yeah, that game was really boring. The Patriots Rams one. The last like four possess or possessions we've watched in this first half, that's what that whole game felt like. All right, they try to set up a screen here for Pacheco. He's going to pick up three or four. Continues to be very good at falling forward, Pacheco. Hamstring for Debo. Questionable return. 40 winners have had too many chances to put the Kansas City Swifts. 40 winers. I get it. 40 winers have had too many chances to put the Kansas City Swifts away. This is painful. Yeah, they have. Both defenses have just played very good football. All right, second and seven. Hand off Pacheco inside. He runs into a wall of guys. Gets three, maybe? Got second and four, or third and four coming up? The 40 winers, huh? Is that because they drink wine? <laughs> All right, come on. I stand by my Chris Conley is MVP tweet right now. I stand by it. That tackle was nuts. All right, third and four, Mahomes to pass. Rolling, pressure, coming. He's going to take off running, and ooh, he's stuck. But he's going to pick up the first down. He knew he was going to take a shot, but he powered forward. Mm. That's the first play I feel like he's picked up with his legs. Lenore gets him. First down. All right. <clears throat> From the 35. Come on. Make a play, Sam Fran. Mahomes, play action. He's running. 33 doesn't even know he's coming. Jesus Christ. Somebody's got to say he's running there. Alert your defenders. That is a 22-yard pickup by Mahomes. Play action to Clyde edwards alaire and then there was nobody. What'd I say? Mahomes needs to start running. Finally, the Chiefs are doing it. Shit. They're across midfield. 43, 44-yard line. 43. Hand off Pacheco. He gets stuck after picking up three. Yeah. This, my stomach is telling me this is a touchdown drive for the Chiefs. Just nauseous right now. It's fucking nauseous. Watch him chip away at the 49ers defense. It's been perfect. Five, fifth, 36 left. This third stupid quarter from the 41. Oh, yeah, I was way off. I said 30 last time. 
Mahomes rolling to his right. Bose is in his face. He's going to throw it away. No flag, no flag. Third and eight coming up. Come on, San Fran. Come on, San Fran. That's another coverage move there. Mm. Bosa was in his face. Just couldn't get to him in time. All right, third and eight. Can you get a stop here? This will be a long Butker field goal. Mahomes dumps it off. They're going to pick up a couple yards there. Lenore on the tackle. Dude, Lenore's playing well. There's a streaker out there. We got a Super Bowl streaker, and they're not showing us. Wow, that takes balls to streak at the Super Bowl. Super Bowl streaker. Yeah, baby. All right, but you're lining up for a field goal. Going to break a possible record here if he makes it. How long is his field goal? They're saying Butker was making 70 yarders before the game. This is a 57 yard field goal. Shank it, Butker. He's so money. Shank it. It's low, but he got it. It had the power. 10 6. All right. The Niners gave up a 57-yard field goal. Grossi got video of the streaker. A little late, but he got him getting carried off the field. All right, all right. Thank you, Grossi. So I was saying, one of your worst, basically, defensive series, you gave up a 57-yard field goal. That's really not that bad when you think about it. But now it's up to the Niners' offense. They just have to answer. They have to do something, anything, literally anything would be nice. Oh, anything. A little Neil Diamond in the commercial here. Dude, I'll take a Neil Diamond halftime show. We got 5,000 people watching the stream. Thank you, guys. We got 3,100 likes. Can we get to 4,000 likes maybe by the time the big game ends? 4,000 likes? That streaker is the most offense we've seen all night. It's the most offensive play we've seen all night. There you go. I co-wrote that with you, okay? I'll take co-writing credits for that one. Do you think you get penalized like harder, more harshly for streaking at the Super Bowl versus a regular football game? And is the pen like is it is the punishment worse if you're if you're naked, if you're actually streaking? Because a lot of people will run onto the field clothed, right? What's the legality if you're naked? Because you're naked in front of all people of all ages. It's probably worse, right? All right, 10 6. 10 6. We need a Niners touchdown so bad. And I want it to happen fast. I don't want to drive. I want one big play for a score. But their offense does not look good lately. Oh, I guess he's only got his shirt off. He's not naked. 
He's got pants on. So. Oh, it could have been blocked that kick. It was a low kick. Should have been blocked. Niners couldn't get their hands on it. Damn. Another missed opportunity. All right, we got a touchback. We got a touchback. Okay, Brock Purdy, do something, please. He wasn't naked. He had pants on. No harm, no foul. Longest field goal in Super Bowl history was made by the Niners earlier, and it just got beat by Butker. Anything can happen in the NFL, baby. I'm surprised 57 is the longest. I mean, that's very long, but. Handoff, McCaffrey, no gain. Mike Pinnell, he's a big dude. Is he an unsung hero on that Chiefs D-line? I don't know. Hmm. Pinnell got blocked right into McCaffrey there. Thanks, offensive line. Second and ten. The Niners, like, on negative yards in the second half, or what? Purdy throws. Incomplete. Looking for Ayuk on the sideline. Coverage was tight. Coverage was tight. Yeah, that's Edwards makes a great play right there. I don't even know if Ayuk would have come, in, come down with the ball in bounds. No, he wouldn't have. But still a good play by Edwards. I hate that fucking sphere so much is something you would see in a dystopian movie and people would say it's on the nose. It's too on the nose. Yeah. I don't know. It's pretty cool, man. I just don't think I could watch you 2 in that thing. All right. Third and 10. Oh, fuck. Is that a false start? Nope. Not called. And Purdy's nearly picked. Niners going to punt. Looking for Debo Samuel. Great coverage again. There's just nothing there. Dude. Yeah. He's lucky this isn't picked. McDuff. Was that McDuffie? Yeah. He was in better position to catch the ball than Debo. They need to get some quick routes. Crossing routes, I don't know what you do. But whatever they're doing right now in the passing game, the 49ers is not working. Punt to the 20. And we got about a six-yard return. Dude, we need a 49ers defensive touchdown. Because I feel like that's the only way the Niners can win this game. And they have the lead right now. They are up by four. And I see their offense doing nothing. I have no hope for their offense. Yeah, Chiefs defense has been great all year. It's been even better in the postseason. I felt like the 49ers would have some better answers for them. They just don't at the moment. Good to see Debo back out there. <clears throat> but get Kittle the ball. He's healthy. Handoff here. Pacheco. Three. McCaffrey, 33 rushing yards. Pacheco, 35. Mahomes has 33 after that long one. McCaffrey's, their leading receiver was 54. Hardman leading with 54. So little offense in this game. It's weird. All right, second and seven. Mahomes, pump fakes, pitches it to Kelsey. A little underhand weird shit there, but it works. They're going to pick up four. We got a third and two coming up. Yeah, a little improvisation between Mahomes and Kelsey. 
Kelsey came up wincing a little bit. Looks like his arm, grabbing his arm. Third and two, McKinnon's in the backfield, trips right. Mahomes looking right, rolling to his right. Bosa's there, grabbing him in the dirt. No flags. Chiefs got a punt. Bosa blew this play up. Luckily, coverage was 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 there early. Mahomes holds on to it, pushes out, can't find anybody. Mm. Come on, snap this ball over Townsend's head. Jim Nance just said a punt's never been returned for a touchdown. And we muffed the punt. We muffed the fucking punt. And the Chiefs got it. God dang it. Did Okay, so the Niners the punt McLeod was waving the return team away and then yeah it looked like he thought it bounced off a 49er so McLeod tries to get this ball and it does it bounced off a shoe it bounced off a shoe and he tried to pick it up and he couldn't in the Chiefs recover Jesus Christ What a disaster. What a disaster there for the 49ers. Mahomes takes a shot right away to the end zone. Wide open is MVS. Chiefs just took the lead. 12-10 is our first lead of the game. Sorry, I can't watch your stream as I watching it on 4K Direct TV and I am 15 seconds behind. That's all right. That's all right. Thanks for jumping in to tell me and giving me money. Lord Taco, gonna go drown my sorrows in tacos and beer. I think that's the right thing to do, Lord Taco. I think that's the right thing to do. Oh, off 28's foot. And then McLeod can't grab it. Dude, that it was like that that play that the Chiefs fumbled and it went right to Justin Watson. The Chiefs have not necessarily been better, but they've been just a hair luckier in this game. All right, well, finally, the, the Niners are trailing, and in this postseason, they've seemed to play their only effective offense when they are trailing. Maybe that helps them. God, off his foot. Oh... Yeah, a lot of game left. Four points is it's not like a, a devastating lead, but the momentum and the Niners offense doing nothing, it feels like a huge, significant lead right now. Four points feels significant. Thank you again, Lord Taco. Rocking with me all year, donating so much money for my tacos. I appreciate it, man. So Niners were up 10-0, right? And now they're losing by three. They have blown another 10-point lead, just as you guys predicted. We got 3,300 likes. Can we get to 4,000 likes? 5,600 people watching. Thank you guys so much. If you're new here, please consider subs. Nope. After the app, nope. Don't subscribe. 
After I can't even say those words, I do not deserve your subscription. I apologize. Purdy looking to throw. Finally has time. Ball hit at the line. Incomplete. Wobbly. Somebody got a hand on it. Better hope. And now Feliciano is down. Niners offensive lineman. They've been struggling with their starting linemen, so this can't be good. Yeah. Oh, Zach. Yeah, I don't I didn't see who got their hand on the ball there, but Casey definitely did. That's a really good play. Oh, yeah. Did you scream in joy or pain? Joy or pain? The curse was breaking the record, then taken away. I know. I know. Oh. This feels like the Chiefs are... How many minutes? 17 minutes and 23 seconds away from winning. Yeah, Purdy's can't get the ball past the line of scrimmage. When he does, nobody's open. I feel like they've got to have a mismatch somewhere with Kittle, you know? You've got the Chiefs corners on your receivers, okay? So that's Chiefs' favor. Get the ball to Kittle. Come on. Yeah, maybe. Go hurry up for the Niners. They need to do something. Kyle Shanahan better have a second script ready. He needs to get to it. Feliciano grabbing his arm, or I think. Spencer Burford coming in. Maybe a fresh body in there will help. It's either going to be great, he's strong, or going to be horrible. No in between. Yeah, Swifties, they're disturbing the force. Got a handoff to McCaffrey. He powers forward on second and ten. They're going to pick up five. Third and five coming up. Which honestly is the best third down situation the Niners have been in since the first half. Just get it. Go back to McCaffrey. Come on, do something. Listen to all the things I'm saying and then do one of them. Do one of the things I want and make it be good. All right, third and five. A short five. McCaffrey goes out wide. Brock Purdy calls timeout. Romo is upset. He liked the matchup they had with McCaffrey out there. Wanted Purdy to snap the ball. Hmm. So each team's kind of had to burn a timeout so far. Mm. Frustrated. What a god awful Super Bowl. Yeah, this third quarter has been painful. The, 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 like what set up the Chiefs' touchdown was bizarre. The bounce off the foot, the Niners' touchdown was crazy, but everything in between has been lackluster. I have a hundred bucks on Kelsey proposing to Taylor on the Chiefs' Super Bowl parlay. I'm guessing that's a parlay. You could really bet on that. Hmm. Hmm. All right, third and five, Purdy alone. Quick pass, finally. Jennings makes a couple guys miss down the right sideline. A positive gain. Biggest play for the 49ers in the second half. 17 yards. Go back to Jennings. Yeah, go back to Jennings right now. Somebody's going to – got to – Somebody's got to have an advantage. Whoa, look at those sparkle shoes. Who's wearing the sparkle shoes out there for Kansas City? 
All right. Purdy, quick pass. Debo got a little room, and he's going to pick up eight yards. All right. Maybe now you play action. Second and two. Sell the run to McCaffrey and take your shot. Or just run it. Just give it to McCaffrey. Pick up two yards. Jennings out there making a nice block. That's what Jennings and Ayuk blocking. That's what got Debo open there. Use check in the backfield in front of McCaffrey. Just follow use check. Follow use check. Oh, it's a handoff to use check. And he picks up the first down. There we go. I knew I was zoning in on use check for a reason. No amount of beer can make this an exciting game. We've got a fourth quarter. Maybe the fourth quarter is going to be wild. Maybe it's going to make up for all the lack of scoring. Maybe the Niners score, then the Chiefs score, then the Niners score, and then the Niners score, and then the Niners score again. Maybe that will happen. That's bad sports. It's a better name. You know, I should have just went with that. Should have went with that's bad sports. Probably would have done a lot better early on. All right, first down for 49ers. McCaffrey has 38 rushing yards and 54 receiving yards. And that receiving touchdown, which was thrown by Jawan Jennings. Just comical. Just comical. But, like... Mahomes, really, Mahomes has made two more plays than Purdy. A big one with his legs and that 53-yard pass that was fumbled the next play by Pacheco, so it didn't really matter. Or whoever fumbled there, I forget. Maybe it wasn't Pacheco. Pacheco lost a fumble, so it was him. Look at all these fumbles that weren't lost, you know? Niners, two fumbles, lost them both. We got a uh, long commercial break. Oh, God. Did we get to 4,000 likes? I forgot. Ah, 3,400. We got 5,600 people watching. Let's get to 4,000 likes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, boy. Are we back? Nope. More commercials. <laughs> So we got a full fourth quarter to play, and this stream has been going for three hours and ten minutes. Normally, we'd be we'd be getting close to the end of the game at this point. About an extra hour, those Super Bowls. Don't worry, I'm not tired. I'm just going to have to pee again. And I'm not peeing, just in case my pee for the D works, because Tom's not streaming. So... By proxy, my P for the D will work, and the Niners have the ball. So I got to hold it. I will pee once the Chiefs have the ball again. I'm going to get a sweatshirt, too. I'm a little chilly down here. 3,600 likes. We added 200. 400 away. All right. San Fran on the 42-yard line. McCaffrey goes out wide. Debo running. Kittle blocking. McCaffrey are pretty throws. He's got a man. It's Ayuk. Blow the play dead. Jesus Christ. They let fucking Justin Reed try to rip that out of his hands forever. But that's a big pickup. 20 yard gain. Ayuk gets open. Finally, somebody's open. Purdy sees him. And we got another first down. Dude. 
credit to Ayuk for just holding on to the ball there. I don't know how he didn't give that up. Refs really let that play out. That was a grown man play, as one Scooter Magruder might say. First and 10 from the 22. Purdy rolling to his right. Throws deep. Oh, fuck. He had Debo and he overthrew him. But, yeah, was it Chris Jones kind of got in Purdy's way here? Yeah. Makes him throw it just in a weird position. Thank you, unsolicited, unsolicited Ditka Picks. I appreciate you. I know you're here a lot. It was a very good year. When I was 17... It was a very good year. Pitch, McCaffrey, he's got a little room, and he picks up eight and a half. Exactly. Not nine. Not eight. Eight and a half. People don't understand football think competitive equals boring. I think we just equate a lack of scoring touchdowns with boring. The third quarter felt quite boring until that muff punt. But I liked the first half. There is nuance there. All right, third and two. Use check. Goes back to the backfield. It's a handoff to McCaffrey. He's looking for the edge, and he loses a yard. He's losing the yard. All right, so you got to kick a field goal here to tie it up, right? Maybe if you gained a yard there, you could go for it. It's a stretch play here. There's just not enough, not enough blocking. Niners are going to go for it. Fuck. You kidding me? You can tie the game up here. If this works, it's genius. If it doesn't, it's fucking stupid. Oh, God. Oh, God. Purdy's in shotgun. This is a quick pass. Kittle gets it, I think. Yes, yes, genius, 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 because it worked. Oh, yeah. He's got it. Kittle got it. Savvy play. Savvy play. Dear God, that was a gutsy call by the 49ers. But now you got to score a touchdown. That's the hard part. <laughs> From the 11. So you still get a first down. It is just a straight-up handoff to McCaffrey. Trying to run in the middle. He picks up two, maybe. Can't you just run behind Trent Williams? If he truly is the best tackle, just run behind him. Put Kittle on Trent Williams' hip, use check, blowing up a hole, and just run to the left every time. Debo Samuels coming off the field. You got a Chief coming off the field. Second and nine. Chris Jones is not in the game right now. Use check runs. Now well, he just does a little motion. Purdy, quick throw. Got his guy. Yes! Touchdown! Fuck yes. Jennings. Jawan Jennings. What a play. They had him wrapped up, but he breaks the tackle about three yards shy and then fights forward. Might have fumbled in the end zone. 49ers use check. Picks it up. San Fran got the lead back. There you go. Great quick pass by Purdy. Good job of just holding on to the ball there by Jennings. And then he breaks ta breaks two tackles. Moody lining up for the PAT to try and make this a four-point game. Nope. Blocked. It's blocked. Picked up by the Chiefs. So now it's a three-point game. Of course. Of course. I had a feeling that was going to happen. 
All right. So they got the lead back. That's what that's positive. Dan Shannable. <laughs> yeah, because he went for it. Yeah. Kick just blocked. Just blocked right there. Oh, boy. Okay. Just decompressing, decompressing, taking a moment. Also had to fire off a tweet. All right. Yeah, I am going to pee for the D. Okay. But don't, I got to wait for the Chiefs to actually get the ball. I don't, I don't trust the full on rules. Don't know if there's loopholes, but I'm going to wait till the Chiefs actually have the, the football. I think that's how I got to do it, right? <laughs> People are saying the curse wheel never fails. True. Curse wheel, curse Jake Moody. And so he just had his, his kick blocked. Poor Jake Moody got the curse wheel in the power rankings episode. I don't I didn't feel good about it, guys. I didn't. But it happened, you know. Sometimes there's nothing I can do about the curse wheel. He didn't miss, though. It got blocked. So it wasn't really a curse on him. More a special teams curse when you think about it. Where is my curse wheel? Why can't I find the curse logo? There it is. Voting for MVP is opening. I still say Chris Conley, MVP right now. Okay. Damn it, curse wheel. Damn it. If we don't get overtime, double overtime, I will riot. Is that a one-man riot? A quiet riot? All right. Let me find the 69 clip. I got to go to GPS. Oh, you fat with a three. Yes, I just said that. That is that man's name. Don't tweet at me. One more. What? Oh, you fat with a three. Yes, I Oh man. I switched. That's ah, my bad. First and 10. Chiefs throw over the middle. Kelsey's open. 15 yard gain, I think, there. Thank you, Lord Taco. Certainly the sloppiest Super Bowl ever, but it's still pretty exciting. We got this, honky sportsman. We got this, honky sportsman. All right. Now I am going to pee for the D. Okay. I'll be right back. Chiefs got the ball. Let's see what happens. Thank you. 
Did it work? Did it? Nope. Did not work. Damn it. Dang it. Now it's just Kelsey again. I just helped Kelsey. 16 point Super Bowl. Lord help us. Uh oh. The curse of 16. Ah. Voted for Conley for Super Bowl MVP. Let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. Who is the MVP right now? Conley. Oh, fumbled snap. Mahomes picks it up. Throws it away. A dangerous throw. Damn it. Another missed opportunity. Oh, my P almost worked. I almost made it work. Dang it. That was the chance. Niners couldn't get it. I don't know what this throw was by Mahomes either. It's a dangerous throw, Patty. All right, so second and 10. Looking to throw here. Got time. Deep left side, wide open. Justin Watson. He's out about, what, the 20-yard line? Jesus Christ. Where does Watson even come from? Oh. Ugh. All right. Chiefs are in the red zone. Field goal ties it, which is significant after that block PAT from the 21. Kelsey running a very slow motion. Does he even get set there? He never got set. Pacheco left side. He picks up nine hard yards. Maybe eight. That was a good run by Pacheco. Eight. 26 left in the fourth quarter. Second and two coming up for the Chiefs. Yeah, just a lot of blocking there. Ah, I think he might have he might have been able to score if he just cuts. He read that wrong. Tried to cut back inside. Should have went outside right there. <clears throat> like he just wants contact so bad. He might have ran into it. I don't know. All right, second and one. Only God can stop him from scoring here. Hand off, Pacheco down to the four-yard line, maybe three. That's a first down and goal. So now the Niners are on their heels. What a shitty defensive series. Yeah, that hole is small. But he just creased right through there. Ugh. Ugh. Come on, turn it over. Fumble. Somebody do something stupid. Rice in motion. Inside handoff. Pacheco. Finally, they stop him. He gets a yard here, maybe. Second and goal. Hey, Armstead's having a nice game for the Niners up front. I think he wrapped up Pacheco here. He's tackled Mahomes twice. I don't know if either one were sack. I think one was a sack. One was just a tackle. That was a good stop. Six forty-eight on the clock. Four and a half minutes on this drive for the Chiefs. Mahomes rolling. Oh, Bosa comes and just butchers it. Oh, nearly picked there. Bosa had him. He got shook. Bosa should have sacked him here. But then Mahomes almost threw a pick. What does Nick do? He got scared. People get stupid when they try and defend Mahomes. 
Mm. Nick did this. He went like this and gave it away. Should have had a sack. Who got their hands on that? 45. All right, third and goal. Hold them to three. Hold them to three. That's a huge win. Mahomes looking to his left, moving to his inside, rolling to his right. Going to keep it, and he is tackled for a little bit of a loss. That's a sack. That's a sack. All right, so Chiefs can tie it up here with a field goal. What if Andy Reid goes for it? You think you'd do something crazy like that? Oh, yeah. Put him in. Put Conley in. You know, he's a receiver. Let's get him a touchdown. Just... All right, so Butker, another chip shot here. Made one from 57, and now he's got a easy... Easy one to tie it at 16. What happens if both teams are at 16? Does that curse everyone? Okay. Well, considering what happened on that drive, just getting, just giving up three, that's a win. That's a win for the Niners, I think. Are we getting set up for overtime? CBS said we're getting double overtime. Is that going to happen? We got 6,000 people in here. We just crossed the 6,000 viewer mark. Thank you, guys. Make sure if you're new here, you subscribe to That's Good Sports. It's my channel. It's not that good, but it is sports. 3,700 likes. Can we get to 4,000 likes? We're so close. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. If the Chiefs win, the only upside of this weekend equal Randy Gratishar finally getting in the Hall of Fame and Grassi winning fan of the year at the Chiefs. Hell yeah, Steve. I agree. I agree, Steve. Longtime Patreon member, Steve. Oh, yeah, you. Hold on. Oh, nice. I got your DM. Saw it late, Steve. Hell yeah. Hmm. Mm, I like that first idea, Steve. I like that first idea. Can they just tie? I mean, it feels appropriate for this Super Bowl, actually. I think they should just be like, you know what? Neither one of you teams deserve to win, so we are actually just going to allow you to tie. Okay. Okay. Seeing if I'm missing anything on the internet. Nope. Nothing crazy. Everybody seeing what I am seeing? Tie ball game. All right. <clears throat> Just waiting for these long commercial breaks that companies paid multiple millions of dollars to have. So I guess they deserve it, I guess. All right, so we finally saw the Niners offense move the ball and score that last drive. Chiefs bounce ba back and answer with a field goal drive of their own. And remember, the Chiefs' touchdown was set up by that muffed punt. So that was probably the best Chiefs drive all game. Ooh, we got a doink. Butker hit the goalpost on the kick. Is that good luck for Butker or for the 49ers? When the Broncos beat the Steelers in the playoffs, the Steelers hit the ball off the crossbar on a kickoff, so it was good luck for the Broncos. Crazy, huh? All right, 546. Can the Niners just milk the clock and end the game? 
On a score? Come on, Purdy. Show us Mr. Irrelevant has ice in his veins. Right away, over the middle, Ayuk. Down at the 48. There you go. That's how we get it started. Let us get it started in here. 23-yard pickup. Good throw by Purdy. Good protection. Oh, that was Jennings. Sorry, I said Ayuk, didn't I? That was Jennings. Jawan Jennings having a nice game. He's th Jennings might be the MVP, actually. He's thrown a touchdown, caught a touchdown. Joins Nick Foles. Purdy, end around here to Debo. He's got a seam, and he's going to pick up 10. Is there a face mask there? No, no flag, but look like he might have had his face mask grabbed. All right, another first down for the Niners. Now they are they got something going. Kyle Shanahan getting his team going late in another postseason game here. Debo on the sideline. Jennings went to the sideline after his last catch, and now you got George Karloftis down. Karloftis looks gassed. He's having him look at his hand, saying it's a hand. Now imagine how good a Lions-Ravens Super Bowl would be. See, that would have been fun. Because I think the Lions can score points on any team, literally any team, and I think they're going to give up points. <laughs> they're going to give up points to every team. It could be the Ravens. It could be the Niners. It could be the Panthers. They're going to give up points. That's why the, the Lions were also fun. All right, so Karloftis, you got to come off the field, buddy. You can't stay on the field after having a finger injury you need looked at. All right, come on. What are we going to do? 429 left on the clock. I want the 49ers to score, but I want them to take off all the time. They need a touchdown. I'll feel slightly better if they get a touchdown here. Second and one. McCaffrey in the backfield. Looks like a blocking set. Debo in motion. Hand off to McCaffrey, and they got the first. Four yard, three yard pickup. Clock continues to wind. Each team only has two timeouts right now. Sorry, let me get the little game cast back. My bad. I left it on the box score. My bad. There you go. I mentioned your Panthers. I mentioned your Panthers. Okay. First and 10 from the 40. Oh, God. Use check in motion. Purdy killed the play. Pitch out to McCaffrey. And there's a bit of a crease there. He picks up five. Clock's going. Clock's going. That's not false start. That's the clock running. Guess it should just be one hand. This is confusing. Okay, here we go. We're getting it. We're going. Three minutes left in this tie ball game. Two fifty-five. Kyle learned. He doesn't have a lead, but he's got his team ready to take time off this clock. Use check in motion. Rolling to his right. Purdy gets the throw off. He had pressure in his face. No gain there. First pass to Kittle. It's close. It's tied. 16-16, Jess. And the 49ers are driving. They're close to field goal range, but they need a touchdown. Or they need a game-winning field goal. Oh, yeah, because they can let this hit the two-minute warning here. Okay, so there's 209. Let it go all the way down. Don't do anything stupid, San Francisco. Yeah, a little motion. Oh, 
That was a little close. All right, so we got the two-minute warning. Third and four. Okay, so if the 49ers pick up this first down, then they can run out all the time. They can possibly run out all the time or close to it. Oh, God, I'm so nervous now. They're within striking distance, but they have been all game and they haven't been able to capitalize. Is this the one time they do? Is this the one time they do? Uh, should go down a little later. Oh, come on, Sam Fran. Just win the game and let me enjoy one night. Just one night. You can say hi. <laughs> Please do so they know I'm not just talking to nobody. <laughs> So, what'd you guys think of Alicia? Uh huh. Little Alicia Keys. <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? <laughs> She's the best. <laughs> Alicia okay. Keys on everyone, the keys. Everyone write the halftime show. Well, see, everybody was not liking it until, well, first when Usher took his shirt off, people started to get a little excited. That's when me and Carmen got excited. And then when the roller skates came out, everybody was like, okay. Now we're talking. Yeah, that was the coolest part. Now part. we're talking. Hi, everyone. Go 49ers. Zero out of 10. Wow, that is harsh for the... Wow, my God. I didn't think Usher was that good, but everyone else was pretty good. I mean, he was good. He was all right. No, he was good. You can't not love Usher. I think it's like if you just... If you don't love that kind of music, whatever the genre is... You're not gonna like the show. Like if you don't like country and it's a country dude, and you're like this. Just, this sucked. They've got to have all the first songs. All were very sensual. It's all the sensual stuff. Then so the party fun. songs came out. Someone gave it a ten ten. Yeah. See. Yeah. It's the all song, over the map. The song choices could have been better for Usher, but it's good that it's all over the map. It's not a unanimous. We hated it. Brought out my best dicks for you guys. <laughs> Coca Cola. Coke and sweats. Who we rooting for? Big Cola. <laughs> we love corporations. They All are the best. Fashion. They should be treated like people, corporations. We got them. All right. Two minute warning is over. A first down is going to be huge for the 49ers here. You got a $9.99. Hi, Jess. I From... say what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, Michael Scott. All right, okay. third and four. That that picture looks familiar. I feel like I know your real name, say what, but I can't. Oh, that's just a dog. No, I... <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on. Third and four. Third and four. Got to pick it up. Got to pick it up. Do something stupid, Chiefs. Ball is snapped. Heat coming is a blitz. Ball hit. Couldn't get it out. Fuck. Steve Spagnolo brought the heat. There's too many men. They had... <clears throat> Why the fuck did they have use check back there to pick up the block, dude? All right, so now Moody's got to attempt... How long is this kick? Four. So is it going to be a tie-up? 53-yard attempt for rookie kicker Jake Moody. This is a long kick. This is for the lead. I don't think. Come on, Jake. Come on, Jake. Punch him in the fucking guts, Jake. Kick is up. He got it. Yes, Jake. Yes. That's why you take a kicker in the third round. That's why. All right, minute 53 left in this game. Chiefs have two timeouts. Plenty of time to work with, obviously. A field goal ties it. Touchdown wins it. <laughs> but I feel like the Chiefs are going to tie it. I feel like we're going to overtime. We're three hours and 41 minutes in. Why not go to four hours and 41 minutes? Oh. Is it Moody you called? What was their prediction? I said he would, if he kicked six field goals and he won Super Bowl MVP, yeah. He's a rookie. He's missed some kicks this year. So 
people feel like he would cost the 49ers the game. Plus he got cursed on the curse wheel. Um, damn that blocked PAT right now sucks. Cause the Niners would have a four point lead. Had that not happened. Just need San Francisco defense to get him. <laughs> Hope you like that guys. Hope you like my crazy, my crazy woman. I know I do. Onside kick. That'd be crazy. Aw, cowards. All right. Touchback. We got a touchback. We got another hi, Jazz. Hey, Buster. Hi, oh, Jazz. Buster. Say hi to Carmi. Hi, all. She just went to Sleepy Slew. No, you cannot do that. She's mine. What's up, Jess? Kristen and Jeff. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I thought they were. They've been there. rocking all night. Nice. Familiar too, guys. There you go. Scott McNew, Michigan man coming in clutch. First and 10, Mahomes, quick pass, Kelsey complete. They pick up 11 yards. I would say find your best defender and get him on Kelsey on this drive. Okay, guys. All right. Still got two timeouts. Clock's winding. Niners bring a little pressure. Mahomes rolling. He's going to tuck it and run out of bounds. He picks up three. Clock stops. Minute 32. Do you already talk about um Kelsey running up on Andy Reid? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's been a huge story. Huge story. For that alone, the Chiefs don't deserve to win. You don't put hands on Andy Reid. You don't put hands on Andy Reid, Kelsey. Who okay, are you? This is the most important part of the game. Let me focus. <laughs> Dude, minute 32 left in the Super Bowl. No dicking around, Jess. Mahomes back to throw, dumps it off. It is actually Noah Gray. He picks up a first down. They're shy of the 50-yard line. They got plenty of time. They're going to be in field goal range in another play. Well, I like Purdue's haircut. Oh, yeah. we are going to overtime. You think? Yeah. This to Justin Watson, complete eight-yard pickup. Second and short. Chiefs are probably going to use their first time out here, right? No, they're going to run another play. 59 seconds. They're playing for the – feels like they're playing for the field goal here. I would. <laughs> Mahomes hucks it nowhere. Out of bounds. Incomplete. Clock stops. Third and two. 48 seconds. Right now, this is a long field goal. We already saw Butker make from 57. Yeah, I know. Now we can't <laughs> breathe. Now this boring game is unbreathable. Thank you, Brad Viking, for joining. Hi, Jess, from New Hampshire. Hi, Janine. Love that name. I've always loved the name Janine. I like the name Janine. These are stats. Wait, this are stats, and I win a new Glock and Nods. I, what? What? All right, third and two. Come on, just get a stop. Force the long field goal with 48 seconds. Heat's coming. They dump it off. It's picked up. It's fucking McKinnon. McKinnon picks up the first. Damn, the Niners could have stopped him there. They forgot about McKinnon. 39 seconds. That's first time out by Kansas City. They're gonna they're gonna take a couple shots. But the field goal is now makeable. It's now a makeable field goal for Butker. <laughs> Butker. This game was really crazy. I don't know if it's good. It's been interesting. Was Usher not great, Jess? I'm asking her because I go to my girlfriend to ask how the halftime show was. Travis is a punk to F with Reed. That's right. He was. You don't touch Andy. Usher was good. Just Alicia liked, was great. Usher was good. Just liked Usher. Just loved Usher. It's just nice when you know every every song, you know, in a halftime show. Yeah, I didn't know any of them. <laughs> Except for the last ones. You wouldn't know those songs. Thank you. I don't feel like the goat right now. I feel like I'm about to be slaughtered. I feel like I'm about to be slaughtered like a goat. Travis Kelsey, the story of the Russ begins with Oleg the Wise back in the dark ages. Oleg? Oleg. I know an Oleg, <laughs> sort of. First and ten. Five wide for the Chiefs. Niners got Warner. Not going to blitz. Thought he might blitz there. Mahomes tackled. Okay, so now Casey only has one timeout. Getting... Now they just got to set up Butker for the kick. They're probably going to throw – Mahomes probably wants to throw one more here. They're waiting for everybody to get back. 
Heading down to the wire. Second and seven. Patty looking. Floats it away. Out of bounds. Third and seven. 16 seconds. Ooh. How long is this kick? Where the hell are they? They're at the 32, 33. So that's a... Got a 50-yard field goal at the moment. No gimme, but I would trust Bucker with my life. Who's that? I don't know. That's Andy Reid. That's Debo Samuel. Dude, if this Bucker is... misses the game winner, I would not I would not expect that. That would be unbelievable. All right, Mahomes looking to throw here on third and seven. Quick pass to Kelsey, and he's got a first down and more, and he's hit out of bounds. Around the 13, 10, nine seconds left. They showed Taylor. And whoever hit him is writhing in pain on the sideline. Is it Gibson that hit him? No, it's 27. Oof. Kelsey took a shot, but we're going into overtime. Unless the Chiefs score a touchdown. Because if they kick a field goal, it's going to be tied. I think close. Yeah, they're very close. Oh, that guy is, you're, you were right to use the word writhing. Yeah, I think he probably dislocated his shoulder, or tore his shoulder. It's like he's in so much pain. It was a, he just absorbed all the energy on that hit. Taylor should be paying that guy's medical bills. Hi, Jess. Love Pernas Channel, part of Grassy Nation. Boom. Woo, Kyle. What do you guys Ooh. think Tom's doing right now? Not caring about who wins this game. Must be nice. He probably cares. About yeah. that. He doesn't care, right? Shoulder to shoulder hit. Kelsey, much bigger man wins. <laughs> he is a giant. Ah, 27's up. Brown's up. He's trying to fight through it. My reaction you yeah. must and go, Niners. Buffalo. We got 7,800 people in here. 10 seconds left in the Super Bowl. They gave him a second back on the clock. One timeout, they got They can throw the ball anywhere because they can call a timeout. So they can throw over the middle. That's a luxury they have right now. Because if you don't get the, the first down, you just call the timeout. What up, Travis? Love you, sweet friend Jess. That's my bud. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Jeff. Thank you for watching religiously. From the 11-yard line, Kansas City. Oh, throw a pick. Do a do a Russell. Oh, low snap. Mahomes gets it. Coverage is good. No flags. Throwing to Kelsey. Oh. Six seconds. Oh, Kelsey wanted that so bad. Warner. You got Fred Warner on Kelsey here. Letting him play. Contact. No flag. Good call. Good call. Good call. Oh. All right, so Butker's coming out to tie it up. We're going into overtime. The amount of holding I saw on the Chiefs O-line that didn't get called today is BS. Yeah, sure. You can always argue that, I feel like. Come on, block it. Just block it, San Francisco. That'd be the most epic thing ever. Nope, we got tie game. Three seconds. Is it really tied? Oh, yep. my God. Kelvin's game-winning TD, swiftly marriage, worked indig com work, work, what? Worked indig comment. Comment. All right. So unless, you know, there's a miracle touchdown by the 49ers. And again, the blocked point after attempt is why this game is tied and going into overtime. We got 8,100 people in here. Don't forget to like this stream. We're at 4,000 likes. If you're new to That's Good Sports, please subscribe. That'd be sick. That's how I feel right now is sick. Uh, <laughs> ask my wife, Jess. Touchback? You go touchback here if you're San Fran? I mean, Kansas City? You're no, I'm okay right now. Do you squib it? Do you squib kick it? Oh, hi, Tama, if you're watching still. Hello, Tama. Okay. 
Okay. Touchback. Dude, if I'm the Niners, I take a shot. If I'm the Niners, I take a freaking shot, man. So is it first kill? No. Um, oh, they changed the rule. Each team gets a chance. So even if the Chiefs get the ball first and score a touchdown, they the San Francisco would get a chance to answer. But they would have to score, you know, a touchdown. All right. They're going to kneel it. No shot taken. Uh, they should have pretended to do the knee. That would have been cool. Oh, God. Is this the first Super Bowl overtime? I can't remember. Feels like it might be. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oof. I don't even know what I would drink right now. Maybe I need a drink. I don't know. I don't know. No, I don't want caffeine right now. There's one more sour beer left. There's a Coors Banquet. Whiskey Coke. All right, we're waiting for the coin toss here in overtime. I'm thinking. New overtime rules incoming. Yeah, each team's going to get a chance to possess the ball no matter what. Three timeouts, replays upstairs. If the first team does score a touchdown and the opposing team doesn't answer with the touchdown, the game is over. Tried, tried. Forty ers are going to take the ball first. Is that an advantage, though, with the new overtime rules? I don't know. Huh? All right, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Overtime rules, peeing for the D, standard. Just pee when the, the defense is on that you want to do well. Broncos versus Lions Super Bowl next year, I believe. Uh, I doubt that, but that would be crazy. I hate being a fan of an AFC West team at the Chiefs. It's torture right now. Autocorrect makes me sound hammered. It did. It did. <laughs> you need some room? Could you imagine Gronk doing that to Belichick? No, I could not. Just love your channel and seeing you with Carmi. She is so cute. Thank you, Archangel. Thank you so much. She's oh, yeah. Asleep. Falcons went to overtime. Dang, Shanahan back in overtime. He's got he's to shed all the demons. He's got to shed all of his postseason demons. Road is not easy for Kyle Shanahan right now. Hell yeah. Thank you, Color. Thank you. Yes. 28-3 went into OT. Oh, I just didn't listen to him. It's I don't, not, not his genre. I don't not like him. I don't like have a, I'm not like anti-usher. I just never listened to him. Can never get into it. Not an R&B kid like me, you know? Oh, you're welcome, Jerry. I'm here to describe it to you. I can tell you this is not the first overtime Super Bowl 28-3. Also, how cool to be. Playoff overtime wasn't sudden death until the second overtime. That would be that would be acceptable. Also, the goat shout out Jess. Thank you, Grizzlow. You're the goat. Mm. <laughs> okay, maybe that's good luck for the 49ers. See, now this this is weird, knowing that like if the Niners score a touchdown here, the Chiefs get to answer. But if the 49ers don't score on this possession, then no matter how 
the Chiefs score, the game is over. Okay. So I almost would have wanted the Chiefs to have the ball first, right? Because then, like, if they do whatever reason, score a touchdown, then you know what you have to do. Fuck. Just one pass to George Kittle for a touchdown. Come on. We need a little luck. The 49ers need some freaking luck. Purdy to pass. Oh, is that picked off? Is that picked off? I thought it hit the ground. I think it's, yeah, it hit the ground. That was nearly picked off. Second down and 10. Good God. Come on. I don't need a heart attack, Purdy. Yeah, this is a good game. Was that ball hit? Let me see. Oh, yeah, definitely hit the ground. Grassi is having the weekend of his life. <clears throat> oh, bubble bath. Yeah, go take that bath. Go take that bath. Oh. All right, second and 10. Purdy looking to throw. Play blown dead. We got a flag. Is that another false start on the 49ers? Is that their fourth false start? Jesus. God almighty. This is why you don't want the ball first. Stupid penalty. Second and 15. I didn't even see it there. I missed it. All right, from the 20. <clears throat> Weird little pass. Shovel to McCaffrey for three yard, two yards. So we got third and very long. <sighs> yeah, you are. Feel bad if you're watching. If you're watching that late. Need some bench warmer. Third and thirteen, and the Chiefs—they just need a field goal to win it. After that, I need a miracle. I need a miracle. God, snap the ball. Purdy looking. Oh. Throws it into the ground. Is that a fumble? It came out of his hand. He tried to pump fake it, and the ball came out. What are they going to rule this? Let's say incomplete pass. Fourth and 13. What a pathetic series. There's a flag, though. Is there defensive holding, maybe? Can we get bailed out with defensive holding? Oh! Oh! <laughs> no, it's an automatic first down. They just got their asses saved. McDuffie. Oh, that's soft, but he got his hands around him. Kind of tripped him up. He trips him up. Fair, 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 fair. That is huge. Dude, they needed the miracle. They might have got it with a five-yard defensive holding penalty. Pitch out to McCaffrey. He's patiently getting three yards. Just keep running pitches right now. Do you want a drink? Oh. Uh, hey, thank you. Just bring me... I don't know. I need to. I'm okay. To those who say rigged, why do you watch? Second and seven coming up for the Niners are at the 30 yard line. Tom will be very tired for GPS. Hand off McCaffrey. He picks up four. So third and short. Kittle's going to the locker room, so the Niners don't have Kittle out there. He's holding his hand and arm in a weird way. 
was running. Yeah, but he needs his hands. He's got catch. <laughs> yeah, Tom's supposed to head back tonight. <laughs> Bernie's trying to tell me to move more to the frame. I'm over here on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> Third and two. Come on. QB sneak. QB draw. Find the hole and just run. No hole. Purdy, quick pass. There you go. Ayuk. First down. 46 okay. yard line. They did something with the same, huh? Yeah. It's a stack set. Had Debo underneath. Patiently waits for Ayuk. 49ers first down. All right. Come on. Now just have McCaffrey rip one. Just rip one, Christian. Just rip a big run. Or get use check the ball. No kittle. Use check in motion. Goes back behind Purdy. Hand off McCaffrey. Left side. Four. Four yard gain. Pretty cold down here. Yeah, baby. It is very cold. Cold in this basement. Oh. They're just hanging in there. 11.30 left in overtime. What if they just take all the time off the clock? What if, what if the Chiefs don't have any time left, you know? That would be a first ever. Debo, motion, Purdy, pressure, dumps it off to McCaffrey, makes a man miss, down the left sideline, pushed out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Fuck yeah. Fuck yes. All right. Come on. Finish it off. Finish it off. Got the cinematic cam. Ooh, little hop step there by McCaffrey. Nice. Needed that. Needed that. Where are they going to spot that? 27? Kittle's back. Kittle's saying he's okay. All right, 26. Keep driving, San Fran. Come on. You got bailed out. Finish it off. McCaffrey, pitch left side. A little bit of room here. Picks up seven. 18-yard line's where he's tackled, and it's going to be second and two. They're going to give him eight. McCaffrey's elbow's bleeding again. I took a, a video when they were screw driving McCaffrey's head on my phone. And before they cut to his helmet, he had a bloody elbow in that game. And Carmi, my daughter, always wanted to see the, the bloody elbow. She's like, show me the video where the guy was hurt, daddy. Hopefully that's a good luck charm. Second and two. Elijah Mitchell. Gets an edge. Picks up first down. There you go, Elijah. Flag, though. Fuck. Holding. What the hell? God, that's huge. That's a 10-yard penalty. It negates a first down. It's second and 12 now. Damn it. They need to score a touchdown. They have to score a touchdown. It's crazy. We haven't seen Turner in a long time. Chiefs offense been on the sideline for a while. That's the only positive i can think of finish the story shanahan dude just pick up the first down here san francisco show us nothing can get you down purdy looking has time finally roll into his right he's gonna make a play he's gonna make a play oh he does is that caught did he catch that that's use check and it's a first down Purdy. This is all Purdy. And then let's see if Usechek holds on. Oh, 
First of all, he's short. Fuck, ball comes <laughs> out. <laughs> That's a football move. No challenge. Not coming from the booth. It's a first down. It stands. Well, it's got to come from the booth. That's a good call. That's a catch. <laughs> Hand off McCaffrey. Oh, he falls forward for about seven or eight yards. The Niners are at the eight-yard line, nine-yard line. Yeah, that was Tony. Did you see? What did I say? That was all Brock Purdy? You said it before. Tony before. Romo says that was all Brock Purdy. We like Tony as a Purdy bought time, did a little, uh, little shimmy, and got it to his fullback. Use check, juice. <laughs> use checks. His wife's the one who makes the jackets. Oh, of course, use check gets them. There you go from the nine yard line. Handoff. McCaffrey runs into a wall, a red wall. Mama Kelsey's wearing one of those jackets tonight, and she's not in the stands. But oh. She said she was going to be. She's in swift sweet. Oh, she got the invite. But they say that Travis paid for the suit. Oh. 1.8 million. Good God. <clears throat> Seems like Taylor. Taylor probably paid for she got, she, got she got more, more money. money. <laughs> got more money. A lot more money. All right, third and four. They picked up the third and 12. This is this is huge. Come on, just fucking score. Come on, just score, San Francisco. McCaffrey motion, fake the handoff to Christian. Purdy just got to throw it away. He had pressure in his face. That guy looks so young. This Jones gets a pressure. Oh. The pressure, they would have had that. IU was getting, or was that Jennings? Jennings was open. So 49ers are going to take the field goal here on fourth and four. It's a very short field goal. Thank you, Josh, for staying up just to watch me. All right, Moody, come on, man. Come on, Moody. Got it. He got it. 22-19. All right, so the Chiefs cannot win it with a field goal. They got to score a touchdown and it's game over. No score, game over. Touchdown is the only thing that can't happen for the Chiefs. I feel like the Niners have to get a turnover. There's just They need a turnover. Defense is well-rested. Chiefs offense been sitting there for a while. Okay? No. No, I'm not. Not okay. Just need the Niners oh. to win. What's up, Matthias? I see your comment saying you're here for me. You're the only one, and I thank you. <laughs> oh, no, people are hanging because of you. They're hanging. Don't sell yourself short. Okay, I won't. Uh... Just me, or should we be seeing a little more shots of Taylor and Blake Lively out there? Mm. Just me? Yep. 8,500 people watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Can we get to 5,000 likes? We got 4,200. Guillermo. Oh, boy. Yeah. Is that true? Chiefs are one and two. I don't know what they're saying there. Yeah, if the Chiefs get a touchdown, game's over. Because <clears throat> the Niners had a chance. They got their opportunity. Happy Super Owl. You're a good man and you have an amazing family. That I do. Thank you. Good work. Keep up the good work. I'm honored to have known you, Brandon Perna. Thank you, John. Appreciate you, John. John. You've been John, rocking John. with us for a long time, too. Oh, God. All right. Touchback. Come on. Smallpox blanket. One of Carmi's favorite games is playing chicken pox with her dollies, so I like your handle. Yeah, smallpox is way worse. <laughs> way worse. All right. One play. Just a tipped pass for an interception. Another fumble. Come on. Come on, San Francisco. 
Your defense, Bosa, strip sack Mahomes. Somebody make a play. Don't get soft here, San Francisco. Get after him. Hand off here, first play, Pacheco. Gonna get three. Gonna get three. Gonna get three. Fudge, 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 Ruckers, fudge, Ruckers. Come on. Oh, God. What do we got here? Second and seven. <laughs> Everyone's tweeting the new playoff rules. Yeah, so everybody knows. <laughs> That's funny. The next score, if it's tied. So it's not tied, so. Oof. So the Chiefs have to answer. Quick pass there to Rishi Rice. He's tackled just shy of a first down. Third and one coming up. Everyone wants to know the rules. Because they were changed for the postseason. Handoff inside. Pacheco is not going to get it. It's fourth and short. Obviously, fourth and short. Not tough. Fred Warner a little slow to get up there. We got timeout coming. Fourth and one. So if Niners get a stop here, his game is over. And they win. 49ers win. But I just don't see a universe where the Chiefs don't pick up a fourth and one. Ooh, that was a good tackle by Hargrave right there. Making sure Pacheco doesn't get the first. Hargrave is a strong man. Throw Pacheco backwards. Okay. That's what it might all come down to. Save us, 49ers defense. God, they need to save us. This is GP Jess. Woo! Even, if this, even if they get this TD, Patrick is still related to Jackson Mahomes. Nothing will quell that shame. All right, fourth and one. Mahomes and shotgun. Fake the handoff. Mahomes is going to take off and run, and he picks it up with ease. Rooting for the Broncos to win this Super Bowl, Chiefs loss. White girl manifesting this Chiefs loss. Join me. Two white girls right here. P for the D. Sorry, Brandon. Jess is way Jess is way easier on the eyes. Yeah, we all know. We didn't say undress. <laughs> say un that is not what that means. All right, from the 41, Mahomes looking to throw. Quick pass. Valdez Scantling's going backwards. Oh, that's going to be a loss. Yeah. Yeah, well, he was, there was a gain that turned into a loss. Not getting forward progress because he broke the tackle. Gotta go down. You got to go down there. He stayed on his feet. So that was a positive play that turned into... <laughs> Three yard loss. Oh, Chiefs are livid with that one. MVS going backwards. All right, come on, sack. Get something. Just make a freaking play. Quick pass back to MVS. Picks up six. Seven. Third and six. Third and six. No, they're not in field goal range yet. Dude, I swear to God, if we get double overtime. What happens for double? Oh, if it's tied at the end of that? Yeah, we go oh, to... There's a Taylor and Blake. Thank you. Oh, my God. Can I get more Blake? Less Taylor. Oh, God. Third and six. Niners bring the heat. Mahomes gets the pass off to Rice. He breaks free and is pushed out of bounds after a big pickup. Thank you, Chris Caps. Jess is back. All right, all right. No, it's NSYNC. How many yards did he pick up there? Backstreet, boys. 
Why is that Back saying fourth and ten? That's Backstreet Boys. Jess is back. That was a big pickup. Brock Purdy kind of looks like Timothy Shallow. They're at the 41 yard line. Mahomes, all day, all day, dumps it off to Pacheco, tackled after picking up four. I don't know why this game's cast is saying fourth and ten. There we go, second and six. We all like football. Oh, Mahomes took a shot after that throw. 9,000 people in this overtime stupid Super Bowl stream. Second and six for the Chiefs. I would say they are in Butker's range right now. The only thing that's going to stop them is a turnover or a penalty. Why wouldn't they just try to make a touchdown? They are. They're going to. But, one, they've got the clock right now. There's 2.48 left in the game. And if they don't get a first down, they have, you know, an option for a field goal on fourth down. Ooh, water girl. You could be water girl. Someone take the water from her. <laughs> Jesus Christ, are we going to go to double overtime? Whoever, CBS, I believe, literally tweeted that we we're going to have double overtime, like as a joke, and we are very close to getting that. Did they really say that? I'm pretty sure, yeah. They should be more careful with all the script writing jokes that are out there. <laughs> Brock Purdy actually looks like he could be a young movie star. All right, second and six. Mahomes dumps it off to Pacheco. He's got room, and he's right at the first down marker. I think they're going to mark him just shy. Yeah. So this is third and very short. Oh. We're going to get there, guys. We're going to get there. Let me get back in the chat see what people are saying since I know sometimes, you know, we need help. Both teams are going to win. That looks like a first down. That's, That's a bad spot. Come on. Let the Chiefs lose the Super Bowl on controversy. Mahomes takes off to run. And he's Nobody's tackling him. Nobody's fucking tackling him. He's down at the 13-yard line. <laughs> god oh my god dude the defense gets turned around always nobody's there to get him oh god <clears throat> Taylor and Blake likes that play a minute 30 left Clock is our friend right now. Hand off. Pacheco picks up four. Grace. We haven't shouted out Grace tonight. That's right. Grace. Give us, give us something, Grace. Grace us with a miracle for the 49ers. Second and seven. 103. One minute left on the clock. Again. Chiefs knocking on the door for a touchdown here. They're at the 10-yard line. Come on, tip pass, interception, turnover. Mahomes has time to Kelsey underneath. He picks up a first down, <laughs> finally tackled. They're going to be about three yards shy of the end zone. I think they're giving him the first, too. They got two timeouts and 30 seconds to take a couple shots here. I want to see. Uh, I don't think he lost any. I don't know. He was a coordinator with the Niners. Bolt up, Harbaugh. All right, from the three yard line, they're gonna hand it off here. Nope, they're gonna take a shot. Mahomes, game over. Fuck me. Oh no. Fuck. You kidding? 
with three seconds left in overtime, Hardman, McColl Hardman, gets the game-winning touchdown. Jesus Christ. McColl Hardman, game winner. Well, that's a bummer. Well, there it is. God, you had it, San Francisco. Yeah. Defense couldn't answer. <sighs> Good God. So annoying. Oh. <laughs> so sad. Nothing funnier than when you got the sad person in the confetti's just falling on them. <laughs> they just have to endure the confetti. <laughs> oh boy. Now I'll make you the drink. Back to back Super Bowls for the Chiefs. Oh Where's boy. Cole? Cole's having the time of his fucking life. That's where Cole is. Is he he's not there, is he? No, he's streaming. It's Kelsey. No. Mahomes is giving a speech. Hey, Purdue, I'm from the Fort up north in no Col nor North Colorado, Fort Collins. Fort Collins? Just want to say I found you in Grassy this year. Love your particular sarcasm and commentary. Made me actually like watching football again. Keep at it. Thank you, Generation 71. This game just aged me 71 years. They can't tease us like that and not give us double OT. I know. It's silly, isn't it? Three seconds left in overtime. God. I feel bad for the Raiders. Yeah, they had to host the Chiefs in a Super Bowl win. Oh, yeah, he's pretty good. He's pretty good, guys. What? The sad people look with their uh, confetti. confetti. The players look so sad. Enjoy it, Chiefs fans. Doesn't make your state any less ugly or flat. <laughs> Sincerely, a Broncos fan. Broncos didn't play, and somehow they still lost. F the 49ers. Shanny, a choker. I felt like Shanny was okay. I feel like the 49ers losing Drake Greenlaw and the worst injury ever really got him. Taylor's like, what? Is winning a Super Bowl hard? <laughs> she don't know. John Elway brings the trophy, right? Dear yes, God, no. My, not, not my Uncle Doug Smith. We've got another Doug Smith in. Oh, yeah, Seth Jones. That confused me one time. Well, thanks for nothing, Blucifer. You tried, Michael. You prayed to Blucifer. He tried and failed. Damn, I hate the Chiefs. Yeah. I think this was the 49ers' last chance. Next year, going to be tough. Seattle and Rams rebuilding. The Chiefs for... Thank you, Chiefs, for beating the 49ers. I want to do things to that woman next year. Whoa. Watch it. That woman's my wife. So I guess the Pokemon theme, vow renewal is not happening. Don't even remember what that is. Don't even Never remember. Never agreed to that. Hate you and your wheel. You your wheel predicted this? Well, the wheel cursed the kicker, Jake Moody. And the a point after attempt was blocked. And that was the difference for overtime. Gotcha. So technically, the wheel saved its worst for the last. Better than Pat's Falcons. Yeah. Two third and fours where Shanahan should have run it twice, plus choosing to receive an overtime. Dude is a moron. Whoa. Buy your TP. Here comes another pandemic. That's fair. Well, I'm going to tweet something like that. <laughs> Yeah, 
Oh, that guy. The chief's on there. Straight to a commercial for Timu. Bleh. Oh, as I said, when they're up 10, Chiefs had them right where they wanted them. Three Super Bowls, Chiefs down by 10, then win. You did say that, Robert. I remember because I thought your pentagram looked like a waffle at first. Chiefs are three and three in Super Bowl games when I buy the jersey. Stop buying the jersey, Justin. Come on. Man, I do hate Brady 2.0. I do too. Another year of stroking the Chiefs off on the way. Yay. At least this was a good game. No bad ref ball. I can agree with that. Last year, you remember the crazy call at the end. Everything is awful. That's true. As a Raiders fan, it was a lose-lose for me. It really was, Perk. Does this mean every team gets a dynasty at some point? Asking as a Jags fan. I don't think it does. But I would live through a Jags dynasty. I'd take it. I think I'm done with football. Pernia, time for baseball. Yep. There's no more football to watch. So, well, you'll got the UFL. UFL coming right when baseball starts. I hope you felt real disgusted, Jaster. Hope you feel shame right now. F the Chiefs, F the Chiefs, F the Chiefs. Bears fan in KC, while I wanted 49ers to win, at least I'll get a paid day off for the Chiefs parade. Please, God, take a quarterback in the draft. You might. I, I don't know what the Bears do. Game over. Fuck me. <laughs> Brandon Perner 2024. That's a perfect way to end this stream. Thank you guys so much for watching along with me. Four hours and ten minutes in the Super Bowl. You guys are awesome. You made it worth it. Thank you, Scott. Please let the Lions beat the Chiefs next year. We cannot have the Chiefs get a three-peat. We can't. No, they've won two in a row. They've won three in the last four years. Or no. Three in the last, I don't know, all the years. There was, a, there was one in, I don't know. It's bad. It's bad. I hate it. Oh, my God. All these supers keep coming in. Fuck. He's right. The Lions, I think, would have won. You're right. We all lost tonight. We really did. Yeah, you were, Jaster. But I still hope you feel disgusting. Feel disgust. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I love all of you. I appreciate you. No, four hours and 29 minutes on the stream. I'll be back tomorrow with winners and losers of the Super Bowl or whatever. And Grassi and I will be back in the morning for GPS. Tomorrow morning? Yeah, should be, unless something crazy happens. All right, see you guys. Good night and good luck.